Hi, folks, and welcome to Paranormous Sight. Yeah, welcome. Hey, everyone. Oh, my God. I'm Hi, so guys. excited. Hi. I'm so excited, <laughs> too, but in full transparency, I have no idea what this is. <laughs> Literally, no so clue. all I know about this game is that I went to read a review about the game. The first line was like, do not look up anything about this game. Do not look up a single fact. Go play the game. You want to go in <laughs> with no context and no clues and no anything. We know and so we decided nothing. to do that. We're taking, you know, it's always risky to dive in completely without any idea of what we're doing. But I do know that a lot of folks have seen uh, this game as one of the most slept on titles of 2023. And I'm awesome. super excited to, to play a mystery game and see what's going on. We've also, yeah. I think we might be doing some voice acting. We might be doing all of the, the short one gaming staples. I do wonder, like, uh, in thinking out loud, when was the last... <laughs> I guess it's AI Nirvana. Too, yeah, it's Nirvana initiative. Yeah, it's the is last the truly <laughs> blind thing, and that didn't yeah. work out <laughs> super well for us. I'm going to be honest. This our, is going to be good. Yeah, our track record for for completely uninformed playthroughs is is a little shoddy. But I am excited, and I think this oh, one's no, going to no, be no. great. <laughs> I've got a more recent one that did work out, which was Slay the Princess. Right? That's true. That's absolutely. There you yeah. go. That's yeah, very yeah, true. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, I know this one is been also highly in stars and time. So that's oh, going yeah, right that, now. Oh, yeah. yeah. Our, our track record is not it's that not tainted, y'all. We're bad. okay. We're just we're making uh, yeah, a but little joke at ourselves. That, <laughs> <laughs> the taint from that one game is some smelly taint. Though, so. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that's where you were going with that, and that is sure where you went. So. <laughs> <Thanks>. <laughs> <laughs> well, Woo! well, we're we starting fresh and we're starting excited. Do we want to dive in, everyone? Yeah. Let's actually, dive was, in, everyone. Are, do we want to introduce ourselves oh, in case yeah. someone is dropping in here for the first time and they've uh, they've Wise. never said hey? Very good call. Wise. Take it away, Allison. Oh, me. Hi. Hello. My name is Allison. And normally I'm the one that has not played this game before, but that's honestly all three of us. So mm -hmm. hello. Hi, I'm Gina. And I've also not played this game. <laughs> <laughs> and hey, I'm Jake. I have also not played this game. Incredible. So incredible. Incredibly exciting for all three of us <laughs> together on this. Oh, oh, we're ready. I'm pumped. Ugh. Let's dive in. Yeah, let's go. Oh, I'm really dropped in for this one. I can't wait. Me it's a Square too. Enix game? Yeah. I didn't even know. Short, you want to take uh, this? Okay, here I go. Ah, oh, you are here. Welcome. Welcome. I have been eager, eagerly awaiting your arrival. I let me find, let me find. Vibes. Is this guy? <laughs> oh, oh, okay, <laughs> wait, wait, wait. I, he's more fun. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the storyteller. I love this choice. Yes. This is so good. Please to make your acquaintance. I shall be your guide going forward. Oh, I like him. <laughs> now then, before we begin the story, there are several things I must bring to your attention. First, then use auto save. The game will automatically save at regular intervals, so you may stop playing at any time. Saving is a very important element of games. It is the only way to keep your memories in place. That's an interesting way to phrase that. Thanks. I'm getting yeah, a very. I know. I know. I'm getting, yeah. <laughs> I'm getting an. We're oddly, talking meta. Yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. I'm getting like an until dawn read from this guy. Do you know what I mean? Remember in yeah, Until Dawn? The, 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 crazy, the crazy witch the, lady that like, what has been shall be. Oh no, that, like that, weird. that's the quarry. I mean, Until Dawn. The, oh, that's the, the quarry. The, like, Shit. the Peter Stormhair guy. Uh, oh yeah. Who's like in the, in, with the books. Mm -hmm, I mean, mm -hmm, I guess mm -hmm. that, that kind of works for both, from both of those games. But yes. Okay. Yeah. The therapist. Yeah. Thank you for Lex. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's exactly what I was thinking of. Oh, I'm also thinking of the therapist from um, Katana Zero as well. Oh, oh um, God, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Weird pull, but you know, okay. If you do not wish to rely on autosave alone, you can also save manually via the menu. Okay, good to know. <laughs> Next, please look at the upper oh, right uh, of the screen. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's right attached Whoa. to the end. Okay, I love his okay. earrings, too. It's actually, um, given this angle, it looks like he's young, actually. It does yeah. look like he's young. He's not an old man. Yeah. Hmm. He's huh. giving me like a like a Sephiroth vibe or something like that. 
Yes. Yeah, I feel well, that. that transition. I, I, I was going to say crunchy. like a Lucius Malfoy, but I think yeah. I like Seth yep. a lot more. <laughs> yep. uh, pretty boy, white hair. They're all the same sure. guy. Yeah. Yep. Uh, yep. Yep. This yep. is the menu button. They all want genocide. They all kill, you know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah, you know. From here. Goes by zero. Yeah, you know, classically. Um, from here, you can check the text log, view useful files, and switch auto mode on and off. You can also adjust the brightness, volume, and other settings in the options menu. For instance, if there is a vo voice you would prefer not to hear, you can mute it by setting the voice volume to zero. Which so that means weird, there will be yeah, it's not some voice out. Right now. Aww. Huh, we'll see. Interesting. I suggest you check the brightness, controls, and other settings now before going on. Okay. This has to be meta, right? Looks like it. Open updates page. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Cool. Oh yeah, Society's and it's a screen like... too. We're clearly accessing like an actual inventory of stuff. Yeah, I'm world. getting Pony Island yeah. vibes a little bit. Um, Total okay. Pony Island vibes. Mm -hmm. Um, um, d you've heard Pony Island Two is coming out. Yes, soon, right? yes, and I'm excited. I'm excited. S yeah, super, super running with that. Um, I will explain other essential functions when the time is right. Ah. Uh, there's one more thing I wish to confirm before we continue. Hmm. It would feel strange to go on without knowing your name. You're too close. Ross, and go. you're getting closer. Ross, you're getting closer. Oh, he's Please. getting closer. <laughs> Tell me what I may call you. Oh, we're, we're kissing the mic too. Hey. Yeah, we are. <laughs> okay. Roscoe. Roscoe. Oh. <laughs> That's I not. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> <Got a deal. laughs> Nice oh, try, oh, the oh, storyteller. Oh, 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 oh. I see your games. Nice try. We've been warned. We know. <laughs> okay. No, okay, storyteller. No. <laughs> oh. How rude of me. Please pardon my mistake. Sorry if it wasn't clear it was trying to pull my Steam username, but it failed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm oh, hey. you. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> I was sure that's what you said, but it seems I was wrong. What came over me? You're not doxing us today, <laughs> storyteller. <laughs> Let me try again. You wish to be called Roscoe. Thank you. <laughs> I see. Very good. I seem to have gotten it right this time. Spoo okay. All right. This is got this is meta. We've got something going oh, yeah. on. Oh yeah. Oh, in minute one, oh, it's yeah. like I observe the files on your computer. Like, yeah, okay. <laughs> well, yeah, that's Same true. Thing records <laughs> our memories. I'm going to acknowledge yeah. the files on your computer. Yeah. <laughs> this game is seven gigabytes. <laughs> <laughs> I am hand drawn. <laughs> <laughs> really? Um, Whoa. Okay. <laughs> All right. Now that we've begun properly, uh, now that we've been properly introduced, let us begin our story. Presented by Roscoe. Presented by Roscoe. <laughs> <laughs> From antiquity to present day, regardless of how society and civilization evolve, death has been a constant presence that none have ever escaped. Whether it's one's own or that of someone close, death is always a difficult thing to accept. This is immutable reality, a value shared by all, no matter the age in which they live. In fact, oral traditions reflecting people's fears and prayers regarding death still remain, ghosts and spirits and so on. Similarly, in attempt to defy death, many curses, rituals, and customs have been born from burning spirits incense to summoning the souls of the dead. Some of those secret arts are still being passed down to this day. Ah, uh, on that note, Roscoe. This may seem rather abrupt, but... Is there someone you wish to bring back from the dead? I don't whoa, like whoa, it when, whoa. They, when, they, when he jump cuts towards us. It's, it, it's yeah, yeah. <laughs> he suddenly gets closer. Yeah. I'm like, no, I don't, I'm not into that. Stop it, stop it. No, stop no, it. no, 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 no. Get back, get back, get back. <laughs> What if, what if you had one chance to use the sacred art of resurrecting the dead? It's still slowly yes, zooming in. Yes, if you in. had the power to bring someone back to life one time and one time only, what would you do, whoa. Roscoe? Whoa, whoa. I do see even setting if I had some... to sacrifice myself. Sorry, go ahead. I was just wondering if this is to set up something like... It, it, with our our starting state 
This is interesting. Maybe. Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. I'd use it even if I had to sacrifice myself. I'd use it even if I had to sacrifice someone else. I'd use it if it came at no cost and I wouldn't want it. Let someone else have it. I'd use it if it came at no cost. Yeah, that's a really I easy totally yeah, it's like yeah. Me too, me yeah. too, yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, absolutely. <laughs> you didn't like that. <laughs> was that good? Was that bad? <laughs> I see. Very interesting. Admittedly, if the choices are sacrifice myself or there's no cost, I'm certainly going to choose the no cost option. Yeah, truly. <laughs> it's like, don't give me the no cost option, man. Yes, yes, that's what I thought you would say. Hmm, what seems to be the matter? Ah, you want to know what this box that has been sitting here is? I have a question, Jake. Are you are you getting closer and further away from the mic depending on where he's positioned? Because if you are, I love it. <laughs> Constantly. I literally yeah. am in my rolling chair. I'm going back and forth. <laughs> Wait, it's so good. I noticed. It's really good. <laughs> it's an excellent <laughs> choice. <laughs> You're adding to me feeling like uncomfortable. It's really good. <laughs> Yay! I love um, it! <laughs> it's quite the curious thing, isn't it? This is called a color television. The world I will be sending you to is full of devices such as this that do not exist in the age you are from. Oh. Mm. In this era, a color television can be found in nearly every household. That is not all. For example, <laughs> if a person should wish to contact someone while they are out of their home. They use public telephones like this that can be found all over the city. <laughs> can you imagine what life would be like in such a time? When are we? <laughs> <laughs> I know, Well, truly. it seems like we're going be... to like, what, the 80s? Mm -hmm. I was thinking, yeah, eight, late yeah. 80s, early 90s, maybe. Oh, I was thinking yeah. late 70s, early 80s. So, like, yeah, but yeah. Oh, yeah, the TV. You're yeah, right, the you're TV, right, you're uh, right. Yeah, but still. Um, And then we're from, who knows? <laughs> yeah. The past. No, not the 80s. <laughs> or, or the distant <laughs> no. future. We're either the past or the distant future. Where it's like, what's a, what's a color TV? But yeah, I think we're the past. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it, it could go either way, but it does feel like we're, yeah. we're about to jump forward in time. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Totally. Okay. Um, I'd be thrilled. Oh, okay. I'm After so sorry. All, I'm so sorry. That is what, no, no, you're good. You're good. <laughs> After all, that is why you came here. No? So let us begin. I have kept you waiting long enough. I present you Paranormasite. A bizarre tale surrounding the curse known as the Rite of Resurrection. Ooh. A peculiar yearn ensnaring nine men and women in a fierce fight for their lives as it unravels. Why is it always nine? Some of the characters appearing <laughs> yeah, within yeah. surely share your views on the Rite of Resurrection. <laughs> I imagine those who have lost someone dear to them will feel particularly strongly about it, clinging to it as their last desperate hope. The first I shall introduce, a man named Shogo Okie, is, is one of them. Person of interest. Person of interest. Shogo Okie. Ooh. Oh, I like his design, Shogo. I really yeah, like the art in this already. Uh, yes. Do you want me to read this? We haven't met this yeah. person. I mean, it feels like it wants us to read it because okay. it's like- Yeah, it does. Kind yeah. of setting it itself up as being pretty meta. Yeah. So let's read it. Let's yeah. read it. So Shogo Okie, male, office worker. Shogo is an unremarkable young man entering his third year of working in the planning department at uh, Hihaku Soaps, a chemicals company headquartered in Sumida. Born in Western Tokyo to an ordinary family around the same time as the birth of the color TV, he grew up amidst the boom of special effects heavy action films, animes, variety shows, professional baseball, and pop music. And pop music. I will say the blue red effect is making this difficult to read, but that's okay. Mm, it's got a little aberration to it. It does, yeah. it does, it does. 
Shogo graduated from a famous private university in Tokyo and has since uh, settled into an apolitical mindset common among those of his generation, with no strong ideals and no particular dissatisfaction with the world as it develops around him. He's content to just go with the flow, having stumbled into his current position by pure chance, and it is safe to assume he will follow that stereotypical path, uh, path of working his way up the ladder, starting a family, and remaining at the same company until retirement. His folk, uh, He plays folk guitar as a hobby and is currently looking for a girlfriend. I get this guy. This guy is my Ken. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I'd be friends with this guy in New York City. You know? I, this guy I can't is fathom a really this normal guy. guy. Yeah, well, but like, yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Oh, no, no, he'd be lame, but he'd be my friend. Uh -oh. I'd always see him and I'd be like, hey, man, how's it going? And he'd be How like, rough, but I'm like, cool, want to grab a drink? You know, you make, you make a compelling point. You make a very compelling point. <laughs> Breaking oh. news. I w oh. oh, I wonder what it could be at such a time. Oh. Early this morning, the body of, dr uh, uh, of a drowned man was discovered at a park in Sumida City. Oh, it's him. Uh oh. Uh oh. Sugar. Oh, I was oh, right. No. Lame. Lame. Oh, oh. That's a problem. Police have identified the body as Shogo Okie, a 25 year old oh, man shit. who worked at a company in the area. Oh. Oh, they're all going to be dead. Yes, okay, probably. That's fine. I get it. I get it. I get it. That makes I sense. I get it. Okay. As a yep, sign. Yep. Yep. As signs of a struggle were found, the Sumida police suspect foul play and have launched an investigation. Ah! <laughs> oh, you're in the TV! Oh, excuse me. Please pay no mind to what you have just seen. Goodness, you near, very nearly saw something that would have spoiled the story. Just <laughs> pretend you did not see that. Let us turn back time a smidge and start again from there. Storyteller literally like, oop, 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 spoilers. Yeah, spoilers. Turn it off, turn it off. <laughs> Do you understand? You saw nothing. Oh, nothing? Wait, what I see? You know nothing. About what? Oh, but what do you mean? I don't, I, I, I don't know anything. Oh, what? I Bro, I'm so anything. sorry to tell you, super know he's dead. <laughs> really know he's dead. This story this is story a work. Is uh, a go work. for it. <laughs> no, no, no. You take it. You take it. I've been talking. <laughs> Stories a work of fiction. All locations, characters, organizations, legends, etc. that appear in this game have no relation to something. In, re in reality. Yeah, we yeah, yeah. We waited too long. The disclaimer of <laughs> any similarities to actual people is <laughs> merely coincidental. <laughs> Shall I? Yeah, go for it. Shogo? Shogo! Are you all right? Hey, can you hear me? Do you want me to be Shogo then? I think you're Shogo. Okay. Go for it. I think you're Shogo then. Oh. Hey, that's not a proper answer. Earth to Shogo Okie. What do you think you're doing, falling asleep here? Ugh, you gave me quite the shock. Come on. Oh, come on now. Up with you. Up! Okay. And... There. How's that? All right? Oh, no. Am I going to fall in love with you, you little <laughs> cutie? <laughs> She's so sweet. <laughs> She's really sweet. She's sweet. Do you feel dizzy? Have a headache? Are your humors off balance? <laughs> Yoko, or, <laughs> or is she gonna betray us? Uh, <laughs> She'll probably betray us. Yes, and yes, I'm feeling very colic, Yoko. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> I'm fine. I think there's definitely nothing wrong with my humors. Now my head's still a little fuzzy. Office worker, Shogo <laughs> Okie. Uh-oh, that doesn't sound good. Turn your head around a little bit to see if you can walk all right. The game is in your control. Drag the screen or move the right stick to look around. Try looking this around is... your surroundings now. Oh, I think this is the only thing I know about this game is the, is this. I think Whoa. you get a 360 view, right? 
Can you spin yeah. all the way around? Wow! Oh, wow. wow. Oh, look at that. Oh, fuck, shit. I no. I hate that. I hate that. Oh. Didn't expect oh. that. Get out of my fucking face, Yoko. Oh, my God. Back up. Oh, back fuck up. That's going to... Ah. I feel like that's going to be the title of the VOD. Your breath smells like fish. Get the fuck away from me. Get out of here. <laughs> oh, my God. I, I just almost, guys, I need to be clear. I, as you were going around in a 360, I, <laughs> I was in my desk chair doing a little 360 <laughs> turn and looked away from the screen. And so by so the time I looked you looked back, back appeared, <laughs> and my chair almost went down, guys. I like fell back. <laughs> We haven't gone very far. We already got uh, jump scared. <laughs> you jerk. Yoko, back up. Personal space, Personal girl. Personal space. Uh. Oh, my God. Uh. <laughs> Good. Good. You seem to be fine. Oh, what a relief. Do you remember anything? Like where we are or what we were doing? The rite of resurrection, or um, <laughs> what, she's gonna feeling? be like, um, uh, the rite of resurrection. Let's come out hot, uh huh? Whoa. Wait a second. When did I tell you about that? Oh, I the mean, animation is cool. It's really good. It is really cool. It's really yeah. Good. I mean, I guess I must have, seeing as you know that name. But, oh, weird. Anyway, you still look a little out of it. Why don't you look around a bit more? Why don't okay. you stay right there and not move? So, mm -hmm. so just mm -hmm. getting the vibe check from y'all. Did mm -hmm. uh, is this prior to our death that was foretold in the um, in the the scene that the storyteller erased, or did we just get brought back from the dead? We are. I think this. Okay, all right, all right. Here's my first stab. I think we are not back from the dead. I think we're in a limbo purgatory type of deal that is representary by things from life or something like that, but I don't believe this is real life. Right okay, now. so you think we're dead or we're something? I think we're, we're dead. Okay. Yeah, cool. I think we're dead. Okay. I I think um we are Mm, I like that theory. I was gonna say I think we might be pre-dead. Like this is we've this is before our proverbial on the news death. But um, so we, now I'm not sure. I like Jake. I like your theory more. <laughs> you know what? Let's let's make this a uh, let, you know let's make this fun. Let's make this a game. We've got one lot on limbo, one lot on uh, pre-dead, and all do she just brought us back just for for the vibes. <laughs> alive. You're right. Yes, alive, but not not resurrected. I like it. I like alive. That. Yeah. <laughs> I'm I'm into pre-dead. Pre pre I want like my good. Instagram my Instagram bio is like pre Jacob Brent Smith pre-dead. Yeah. Pre -dead. <laughs> it's more of an omin ominous but factually true. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, so we need to look around. Uh, Does she have anything else to say? Okay. Look around and select things you want to investigate. You can converse with people by selecting their faces. <laughs> Just grab them. What? <laughs> Hello! Oh, oh wait, I have wait, wait. something to say to you. <laughs> like grabbing their face. Yep. Yeah, oh, God. <laughs> That's literally <laughs> the little squinch their cheeks. <laughs> These yep. telephone booths are all over town. The lights are always on, so they can be used in an emergency. Oh, I had another updated theory. Mm -hmm. what oh, if, go for it. What if we, Roscoe, are actually um, possessing this man? Also possible. Instead of it being Oh, Shmuel. that's no. interesting. So Roscoe is a person entity, and I'm sorry, that's the right meta yeah. thing to be thinking about. That's fair. Storyteller said we were being brought forward or, you know, brought into this time period. So that, maybe, that makes maybe sense we're to a me. ghost. I don't know. No, and, and games love to do the man behind the um, computer trope. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and if we, we introduce it first thing, it's better than AI the Somnium Files Nirvana initiative. Damn, so. dude, coming out hard and swinging. Okay. I told okay. Allison this. I'm just I had, trying to make enemies. No, I know. I, I told Allison this, but I had lunch uh, with a, a friend and I mentioned uh, AI Nirvana initiative. And I was like, yeah, AI Nirvana initiative. And they're like, oh man, so much better than the first game. Am I right? And I just Ooh, sat there no. stock still like, 
I don't think I've ever disagreed <laughs> with anybody more, but I'm interested to hear your story. Um, anyway, of this is a Of course I'm so salty. I'm going to be dragging her until the day I die. I was not kidding in the final episode when I said my least favorite game I've ever played. I will keep taking shots. I'm not over it. I'm pissed. <laughs> I'm mad. <laughs> You're allowed to process however you feel like you need to, and that is totally yeah, valid. And and throwing indeed. a tantrum, <laughs> bitches. <laughs> uh. No, you're right, people. You're right, chat. People really do be loving Nirvana they initiative, do. and it blows my fucking mind. The best part about like this I conversation is I was like, you know, I went on like a little rant about why I didn't like <laughs> it, and then I was like, and Ryuki is like such a forgettable protagonist. Like, which one's Ryuki again? And I'm like, exactly. Exactly. No way. No way. <laughs> <laughs> that's, Thank you. That's, Thank that's you. hysterical. That's ridiculous. Anyway, anyway. Because at least, like, <laughs> even if I disagree, it's the people who, like, love Ryuki. I'm like, well, at least he made an impact on you. Yeah, honestly, <laughs> I, I, I appreciate that for them. <laughs> okay, all right, all right, all right. Back on track. That's all yes. right, all right, all right. Like different, different, playground. different playground. thing. <gasps> who oh. needs to sleep? I appreciate the sub. Thank you for the gift sub. Thank mm -hmm. you very much. I bet it's crawling with kids during the daytime, but it's kind of peaceful here at night. Hmm. Where are we? Oh, right. This is Sumida City, Tokyo. We're in Kinshibori Park near Kinshicho Station. Yoko brought me here saying she needed my help with something important. It's just past midnight. That explains why there's nobody else around. It pre might dead, just be Shogo. Pre-dead is looking pre -dead, more but, uh, likely. <laughs> pre-dead. Yeah. Pre-dead. Okay. What's up? You're again, in the space there. Yikes. That was close. If we died before we got our hands on the rite of resurrection, everything would be over before it started. Uh, <laughs> wow. I guess, just no. really casually said that. Yoko. <laughs> This is Yoko Fukunaga. Good. At least I can remember that much. I first met her about a month ago. She's 23, works as a housekeeper, and is really into the occult. Oh, a new friend. I, I mm. The trope is always old friend. Yeah, you know what I mean? and they were giving off yeah. childhood friend vibes, but new friends. Yeah. Intriguing. New friend. If I think harder, I can probably recall a little more about what's going on. We've only met a few times, but we really held it, hit it off. She's a lot of fun to be around. I have no idea how she feels, though. I get the sense she isn't thinking about me that way right now. But I know I've got a thing for bubbly girls who are into dark things like the occult. <laughs> me too, my guy. I get it. <laughs> I told you we'd be buddies. Jake type unlocked. <laughs> okay, I have a Not sure the dating button. profile. Like, what are you into? Like, you big eyed girl has to be into ghosts. <laughs> You gotta also be pre dead. <laughs> well, the, the, good. Pre dead I mean, I into dead. ghosts. Fond of ghouls. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna click the recall button if we're cool with that. Yeah, do it. Sure, yeah. Let's Let see think. what that does. What can I remember? This is spooky Google Earth, you're right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Her name is Yoko Fukunaga. We met about a month ago. What's the deal with this park? Okay, now who is that? That's us. Uh, R R Roscoe, right? What, what are what? what? What's no. happening? No, what? This is, no, no, no. This is, this I think we're Shogo. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Okay. This is Shogo. He said okay. I might be able to recall something. Oh, okay, he's doing a recall. Yeah. Okay. It was around noon on one of my days off. I had just finished running some errands in Kinshicho's uh, Kinshicho, and was here taking a quick break. I was just looking around absentmindedly. Oh. And I noticed this girl loitering about. She's digging up holes in the sandbox and searching around the playground. She seemed to be enjoying herself. Talking to animal figures and petting them on their heads. <laughs> My curiosity got the better of me before long and I struck up a conversation. Hey, are you looking for something? Hmm? Ah, uh, oh, sorry. 
I must look like a total weirdo. Um, yeah, I guess you could say I'm looking for something. If you want, I could give you a hand. Really? I mean, that'd be a huge help, but... But? Are you really just a good Samaritan? Or are you after, you know, something else? She says, smiling placidly. Skills. <laughs> you, wanna... <laughs> you looking to level up? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm a good definitely Samaritan. The other definitely thing. the other thing. <laughs> Wait, I uh, want to say definitely the other thing and hope she knows we're joking. <laughs> but I think that's funny. This, you know what? This can be a learning moment. Let's see what happens. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> the storyteller jumps in and is like, I'm so sorry. You scared her the fuck away. <laughs> don't say that. Yeah, don't, don't say weird things. She Roscoe. yells pervert and runs away. Yeah. <laughs> can, can she pick up that we're flirting? Okay. Yeah, I'm yeah, right. <laughs> oh, you're funny. Hey, at least you're upfront about it. Okay. I guess I'll let you help me. Be warned, you might regret what you've gotten yourself into. <laughs> no worries. What are you looking for, anyway? Did you lose a bracelet or something? Mm, not exactly. I'm searching for one of the seven mysteries. Supposedly, this is the location of the Whispering Canal. The what? Oh, oh now I've done it. Oh, I bet you think I'm some kind of lunatic. The Seven Mysteries of Hanjo. Do you know anything about it? I figured everyone around would have at least heard of it, but I guess not. Hanjo is what the southern part of Sumida is called. A long time ago, this part of Tokyo was split into two separate cities. The north was uh, Mukojima and the south was Hanjo. Huh. Uh, am I boring you? Well, I'm not a local or anything. I just work around here. Oh, then no wonder you didn't know. Well, the Seven Mysteries of Hanjo is a legend dating all the way back to the Edo period. Really? It's that old? That's like over 200 years ago. Oh, I've got your attention after all. I just assumed it was one of those fake stories made up to chase the occult craze. <laughs> I don't blame you. A lot of the popular stories going around are pretty fishy. But the seven mysteries of Hanjo are different. Because they're all true! They're true? That's what I said! They're the real deal. So, okay, hold on. What does that mean? Are you telling me there's actually paranormal stuff at work in this park. Yep, pretty much. But there's got to be more to it. After all I've done, I still haven't found a thing. That was the first time I met Yoko Fukunaga. Ooh. Okay, cool. Updates, open updates page? I guess it doesn't matter. Okay. We exchanged contact information and we've talked over the phone a few times since. We've even met in person once or twice. But she never brought up the seven mysteries of Honjo again. I figured she'd gotten bored of it. Interesting. So, so just just giving context for what it is we just saw, I'm assuming we will meet more people on whatever this journey is, but we'll get to recall our relationships with them and flashbacks to them. And, like, w you know, if recall was a button, I feel like the button will come back. You know what I mean? Yeah, that makes sense. It's yeah. like I'm wondering. I'm wondering how this is going to work. It seems like there's seven mysteries. Okay, we got that. And also, we're probably going to be influ like interacting with different protagonist characters because of how the storyteller introduced this. So, is it seven unique standalone stories, or is Yoko going to be like a constant through them? And everyone's going to die around her. That's. Well, that's the real question. Do we have other protagonists or are we always Shogo? Or are we jumping from protagonist to protagonist? I don't know. That, this is the part I, I we do know. not know yet. Yeah. So yeah. Shogo guess, may just be the main character. That's definitely know? possible. It may just be that we know Shogo. Well, we have been told by a TV that Shogo dies. Um, but Shogo mm -hmm, is the mm -hmm. protagonist. That's a good question. Uh, until today, when all of a sudden she decided to resume her search. Huh? Wait a second. Where did Yoko go? 
Yeah. Oh, to the bathroom. There. Okay. There she is. <laughs> <laughs> She's back to digging up She'll holes be right in back. the sandbox and searching around the playground. She seems to be enjoying herself. Talking to the animal figures and petting them on their heads, which is the same exact wording the I used last time. same exact line. <laughs> uh, no animal needs that much petting. Oh, nope. That was not loud. That was to myself. That was to myself. To myself. To myself. Oh, I, th I thought you would have said that out loud. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> According to Yoko, the Whispering Canal, one of the seven mysteries <laughs> of Honjo, is around here somewhere. I'm laughing at chat saying no heavy petting. <laughs> 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 Stop sounding like my high school teachers! <laughs> <laughs> it's apparently the story that uh, the expression left at the canal originally comes from. I think I left myself a note about it. I should check my files. Heavy petting has always been my absolute favorite description of a sexual act. I think it's so <laughs> funny. I think it's so funny because imagine having an intimate moment with someone to be like want a heavy pet <laughs> <laughs> like, who would ever say that want to go over there and pet heavy, heavy? no let's it, go pet oh, heavy man. over there i yeah, want to like, pet you and i want it to be heavy it is a euphemism <laughs> exclusively used by people uncomfortable with the conversation and that is funny yeah. <laughs> <laughs> i guess it would be weird if your middle school teacher was like no hand job yeah no it's exactly like, okay. it's, it's, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. it is a euphemism <laughs> for a reason uh, I did want to draw attention I to just this, like, we could recapture do thing that's going on. Oh, it's changing. What? Huh? Oh, weird. Oh, don't And like it's that. all TV screen-y. It feels like it's being affected by where your cursor is on. And so you're, what, getting no, lines it's just of going. No, it's just going on its own. Oh, damn, you're right. Yeah, okay. it's just going yeah, on its, it's own. Yeah, it's just... And it's different every time, right? Nothing has cycled, right? Um, okay. Uh, I'm, yeah, I, I, if it cycled, I didn't notice it. Um, okay. So that's, Ooh. uh, okay. So we've got a file on the Whispering Canal. An enduring superstition, formerly known as the Kinshibori, many fishermen once gathered on this section of the canal that ran through Honjo. As their days came to a close and the fishermen gathered up their catches, a terrifying voice would rise up from the canal whispering, leave it behind, leave it behind. Those who ignored the Ooh, voice okay. found themselves unable to move and their previously full baskets of fish emptied. They would then be dragged into the canal, never to return. This strange phenomenon continues to occur, and the people who call this body of water, and the people began to call this body of water the Whispering Canal. Yo, wait, wasn't Shogo found dead, drowned? Is that right? At the beginning? Is that how was it drowned? I thought it was just was there drowned? was it was it was, was, it just, uh, was it just under found suspect dead. circumstances. But you might be right. Okay, I might be just Wait. making that up in my brain right now. You might be right though. But in full transparency, I was reading for the storyteller. I don't remember. Okay, found drowned. Chat says drowned. Found drowned. Cool. Okay, found that's drowned. what I thought. So, yeah, yeah. Let's okay. keep that in mind. I, so th there's Sumita. Thank you for confirming. Okay, there's Sumita. Okay. Tonjo. This is the park. The occult craze. I'm going to actually read this because they referenced it. Paranormal phenomena, the supernatural, aliens, cryptids, lost civilizations, ESP. The list goes on. Such unexplainable phenomena are quick to take on a life of their own. A plesiosaur named Nessie living in the Loch Ness. Sightings of a mythical creature like the Tsukinoko? S Suchinoko? Su Suchinoko? Uh, yeah. Or the uh, Hibagon, the urban legends of the Kuchisake uh, Ona, the television reports of spoon bending psychics, documentaries which feature mediums and spirit photography. These are only a few examples of stories that have captivated the public. There's no end to this obsession in sight, with magazines on paranormal phenomenon enjoying widespread publication. Most recently, rumors of an ancient ritual known as the Rite of Resurrection have been spreading in certain circles. Okay. Per the Suchinoko is a, is a little fat snake that uh, Dunsparce the Pokemon is based oh, off hey. Thank you, Emperor Sofa, for reminding me of that. I love that fact. Cool, <laughs> cool stuff. Okay. Um, I, I'm i gonna make a prediction. Okay. Uh, can I make a prediction? Sure. Uh, I think that Yoko is going to kill us in the this rite of resurrection or whatever, because I think she's gonna try and murder us to bring someone else back. Okay. That's my Whoa, I, I, that prediction. feels legit. Okay. Yeah. 
Yeah, big, 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 bold prediction. But Coming we'll out swinging. It does feel like it's telling us she's gone off the deep end a little bit. Like she's behaving weirdly now. She's talking to inanimate things, stuff like that. Jeez, she's still at yeah, it. Yeah, we'll see. Okay, I'm gonna recall. I'm more okay. just saying that, that that might help in the driving her to do something rash, like mm -hmm. sacrificing us or something. That's right. She asked me to come here to help her look for one of the seven mysteries. Actually, I think I did some research on the seven mysteries of Hanjo. I can't remember all too well. I should check my files. Okay. Is there another one? I thought we just... Oh, oh these are all God. of them now. Oh, these we've are added the seven them mysteries. all. Whoa. Yeah, we can take turns reading through them if you want. Okay. You want to do the Fool's you don't pr pr uh, Procession? Sure, I'll do the fool's procession. An enduring superstition. A mysterious tale regaling an encounter had by a daimyo at his residence in Honjo's uh, uh, Ushijima, now uh, Komagata High School. Oh, no, it's now a high school. Uh, when walking around his estate, he heard the sound of music, much like that of, of a Kagura performance. Uh, his, he commanded his people to find the source, but no matter how they searched, the music would fade when one neared the, why, there's a lot of words in here, uh, Warigasui Canal. Uh, the, I, I'm very curious if these are all actual locations in and around Tokyo. I imagine they would be, right? Yeah, I imagine they would be. Potentially? I don't know if the, 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 um, folklore is real, but. Yeah, yeah. I don't know about the, about the folklore, but I imagine the places are real. Um, cool. I, I, that's cool. Oh, chat says they are. Awesome. There you go. Um, the source of the sound was never located. This story is also known as the procession of the Tanuki, as many, many were the belief that it must have been these mischievous tricksters behind it all. Huh. That's cool. Okay. Cool. Sorry. Okay, sorry. I I was just trying to figure. Oh, out. there's so many. Oh, there's wow. a lot. Yeah, there's a lot of. Here, let's 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 progress. But we know these are here, and we'll read through okay. them as we okay. as we sure. go. Okay, that's fine. With me. I think every now and yeah. then we can dip in and read one. I think that's a good. I was gonna idea. say, is yeah. that more than seven? Actually, can. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it is. It's just stuff. Is there's like twelve? How, how there's many there mysteries? There? It's one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh wait, one, nope. two. Yeah. Uh, uh. Yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> Seven? More no, than seven. It's ten. More than seven. Yeah. Or, okay. It's ten. No, it's nine because for whatever reason this starts with two. What? Okay. I don't know why. <laughs> what? That is. There's Whoa. a lot of there's a lot of I mean, stuff here. And then this, this goes is to twenty one. And that says so we're missing what? one. Question mark. Yeah, we're missing. I guess the they'll file, fill file stuff in. One. Yeah. Whoa. And we know there's going to be nine people involved. Oh no! In this. Number one is how to play. These these are just filters. Oh. This is just filters. Oh, no, oh, oh, oh. No. click on the seven mysteries. Oh, Click on yeah, the seven no, mysteries. No, I know. It, that removes, yeah, that, it starts with oh, two oh, because okay. number one is how to play. Got it, got, got it. it. Okay. But still, that, so it's nine. There's nine things here because okay. the top one is Mr. The description of the seven okay, mysteries. Okay, heard. Okay, all right. Great. Okay, okay. <laughs> Yoko, hello. Ah. Oh, wait, she's, <laughs> she's coming scary. back this way. I, yeah, no, she's I very like off putting. Her. <laughs> ah, fucking stop, Yoko! Get back! <laughs> Get in our face! What did you eat today, girl? What is this weird fish smell? I'm not no, into no, it. No. Three feet. I got Three fucking feet. I got basil a bone, uh, thinking oh. it was full of peanut butter, and I was being a, a loving, great dog owner. And whatever is in that bone is the, the most noxious smelling material <laughs> on the planet. Even uh. it being in the house makes me wretch. And so now it's this this horrible game of like, where is that thing? Get it out of here. Uh, because she'll sneak it back inside. I keep putting it outside and she'll keep sneaking it back inside because it's her favorite thing. Um, so I'm just gonna assume <laughs> that. Hey, what was that just now? Huh? Didn't you hear that? Now that you mention it, you're hearing things. Did we hear anything? I did feel like I heard something. I'm not too sure, though. Hmm. That was creepy. But your special talent! You should have been able to hear it! Pay closer attention for me, okay? My special talent? What are you talking about? Huh? I mean your spirit sense. 
You look like you can handle your liquor. Hmm? Huh? I have no idea what drinking has to do with it, but uh, I, I don't think so. I also was like, <laughs> Fairy Hugger, I'm with you. I was like, he's an ultimate. Oh no, <laughs> his special talent. Hmm? Well, you must. I mean, you can see me, right? Uh huh. She's uh, a ghost. It, ooh, 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 she's, she's a, a ghost. ghost. Ooh, ooh, she's a ghost. Ooh, spooky scary. Can I just say what a what a power play if she's not? And she's just like she's just like she's a lying woman with you. Them. Yeah, she's like you can see me, right? Can you imagine if somebody like just decided to fuck with you like that? <laughs> I mean, if he's into, like, girls that are into spooky shit, he might be like, ah, Oh my god, she's so hot. Fun. She's unresistible. She's so hot. <laughs> she lied to me about being dead. Ah. <laughs> Can we recall? Uh, well, I was going to click on her first, if you're okay with oh, that. Oh, okay. Are we gonna, does that mean we lose the recall? No, I don't think so. I've recalled at the oh, okay. end after I've clicked on things a bunch. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Uh, wait. <laughs> wait. You're kidding, right? Uh, about what? I, I mean, just now. It kind of sounded like you were saying that only people with spirit sense can see you. Of course, that was a joke. Duh. You don't really think I'm some kind of evil spirit, do you? But yeah. I mean... Oh, I meant what I said about your spirit sense being strong. I bet you could down a whole gimlet in one gulp. Seriously. That's the real reason I asked you to help me with this seven mysteries of Honjo business. Okay. Just <laughs> clarify something? <laughs> Are you saying you can actually see paranormal stuff? Sure, I could handle a solid Moscow mule. Babe, I'm gonna need you to like two notches down for a moment. <laughs> Why are you measuring this in terms of cocktails? <laughs> Not a believer, huh? Well, that's no matter. Uh, she's right in she's my face. She's right there in the face again. Why do you <laughs> smell like that? She's been drinking, okay, to see the spirits. <laughs> are they like, wait, wait, what are those shots? Uh, we're really getting closer. What are those shots that are like fish juice? Have you ever seen that? No. Remember that? I don't know. No. They're like pickleback oh shots, but, but they're like with, with fish with juice fish or something. Oil? Oh, <laughs> yeah. oh, no. It's I'm still sorry. getting closer. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. still getting close. We gotta progress. I gotta progress. We gotta progress. We getting? I gotta progress. Oh, she stopped oh, no, she's getting She's going closer. back out. She's going back out. She's but, going back out. Okay, all right. But you have to have seen some weird stuff over the years, right? Weird stuff? Yeah, like things you could see but could never understand. You can't be serious. <laughs> About spirit sense? I've seen ghost photos in magazines before, but... Are you telling me they really exist? You bet they do! But you can only recognize them if you really believe in them, so be careful! So, even with my skill... I wouldn't be able to see them if I doubt they exist. That's right. The spirit world is all about the mind and the soul. You won't be able to see a thing unless you're properly in tune. Interesting. But sometimes people get caught up in the moment, thinking they might see something, and then they really do because they believe they would. Is that how it works? Yep. Just like drinking. You'll never know how much booze you can handle unless you're ready to down some shots. I'm still so not sure get I get the sloshed. drinking thing. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I realized how strange it was as the words left my mouth. Sheesh. Is it worth recalling or no? I, Maybe not yet. Is that it, how till, it works? I, I figured it's just like when you run out of things to do, that progresses the scene. 
Oh, that's what it's oh, done the past yeah, couple of so times. Too. Yeah, you know so what? I'm not, yeah, I'm not clicking it until we're done. Good call. Good call. Good call. Yep. About alcohol. Uh, <laughs> totally unrelated. Uh, but do you actually drink real alcohol? I mean, she's 23. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. Talk about whiplash. I didn't expect you to start making small talk. Well, <laughs> our conversation was getting a bit dark. I figured a change of topic might lighten things up. Oh, I see. If you really want to know, I like to think I can handle a few drinks. But to tell you the truth, I've never actually had a Moscow mule. Really? Not? Really? That feels like <laughs> such a starting drink. You know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's true. Like, it's like two ingredients. It's super simple. <laughs> but it feels fancier than being like, give me a Jack and Coke. It's like, let's go. Right. Like, Whoa. It's I'm like, it's like a gin and tonic where it's like a party drink when you're like, I know how to make this and it will be consistent. So at least I'll make yep. this. Yeah. And right. I like probably if I have any sort of alcohol in the house, have the right things to make. This. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. It's, it's definitely an easy one to make at home kind of drink. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> you know what drink I made before this um, stream was an espresso Negroni, mm. which is my favorite right now. So I've much never food. had an expre espresso Negroni. It's awesome. Oh. It's so easy. You just make a normal Negroni, equal parts, gin, dry vermouth, Campari. And then if you're doing like, I guess proportionally, I doubled them because I made it for Wilson and me. So I did two ounces of each of them. And then um, uh, like uh, 0.75 ounces of any sort of coffee liqueur. I use Mr. Black, but mm. anything's good. You just throw that in. It's a little something that makes it more interesting on the back end. It's like, Ooh. it's my it's my favorite drink probably. I Intriguing. mean, my favorite like that I can make. If I go to a bar, I get like paper planes and stuff like that. But um, it's a great one. Highly recommend, you know, good coffee liqueurs are only like 30 to $40. So it's not too bad. It's fine. That I, will, so I will try good. that in the future. Thank you for the rec. Yeah. Yeah. That is a yeah, great totally. idea. Mm -hmm. I'm going to ask Victor to make me one of those. It sounds awesome. They're tasty. They're easy and super drinkable. And yeah. yeah. Oh. Nice. Uh, she mentioned Moscow mules. Uh, there's a there's a place uh, around where you used to live, Gina, that did mezcal mules. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. And those are really good. I enjoy yes. it. I love the like ginger ale and mezcal, like just the spokiness. Oh, just ginger ale just plays nicely. It plays so nice. Ooh, I guess one more before we move on. My favorite bar in town has a signature Moscow mule that uses salted caramel liqueur. What? And it is amazing. What? What? It's amazing. What? It's so flipping good. So it's like a normal Moscow mule. Like you still use vodka. You still use ginger beer. You still use lime. But then they top it with this really, really good house made salted caramel liqueur. And it's fucking incredible. It's absolutely my favorite drink in the city. Dang. Anytime I go, I'm, I get so excited. Dang. Dude. Oh my God. That sounds so good. It is. It's awesome. Oh, <laughs> it's so tasty. Wow. Well, sure. Ah. Mixology is so fun. It's so wild. Just flavors I'm, that you can make is so cool. That's why I love it. It's just, crazy. Ah. And look, as I love taking any opportunity. Your husband is my favorite <laughs> mixologist. He makes such cool shit. Thank you get to try you. such neat drinks because of him. Mm -hmm. I'm is he in spoiled. chat? Victor, I'm are you spoiled. in chat? Uh, I hear he's watching dishes right now. I can hear him at the sink. <laughs> Curses. <laughs> <laughs> Curses. He's, in, he's busy in the kitchen right now. <laughs> every time we, we, we try to, to support him, every time. Uh, but seriously, follow his uh, Instagram. It's beautiful. Yeah, it's go find it. It's beautiful. Go What's find him on Instagram. Uh, Victor's Victuals uh, with the underscore. Victor's. It's literally, underscore. go look. He, like, he really works on that. How do you say it? Vittles? Victuals? Vittles. Vittles? Yeah. Is that how you say it? You don't pronounce the C? No. Oh, Victor's Vittles. Well, there you go. I've never said it out loud. <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> Wait, no way. No way. No way. Are you no sure? Way. Yeah, I'm Gina? pretty sure you pronounce it Vittles. That, that sounds crazy to me. <laughs> <laughs> I, I know you typically are right, but that sounds absolutely preposterous. Are you Are you sure? I'm like pretty Pro sure, yeah. I trust you. I trust you. 
I trust you implicitly, but that like really rocks my world. That's true. Yeah. I'm I'm like, right. Yeah. I'm like, I was about to say, I'm pretty damn sure about this one. Like I'll backtrack when I'm doubting, but yeah, I'm pretty sure. Whoa. Uh, (laughs) Say it again. Say the word again. Cause I'm saying it wrong. Vittles. Yeah. (laughs) <laughs> wow. What? Wow. Look at that word. Why is that word middle? Sometimes English does that. Yeah, sometimes English just does that. I don't know. <laughs> wow. Did, I, I must know, Victor. Did you know? Did you know it was Vittles? <laughs> <laughs> he's not present right now. He cannot respond. Wait, did he no, just say no, something? He said he, he just said checking something. on his moonshine. Oh, sorry. <laughs> is that sorry. English or is that us borrowing something from like the French or something like that? It's that probably an inherited word that's gone through like four or five different whatevers. But yeah, <laughs> vittles. <laughs> I'm pissed off. That sucks. <laughs> <laughs> okay, anyway, Nochi Sad, I must say, I do like vitties. <laughs> <laughs> Give me a little vitty. <laughs> a little vitty. Uh, I threw the link for uh, for uh, his Insta and chat if anyone is curious and wants to see uh, some of the cool cocktails he makes. Um, <laughs> yeah, he's very talented. <laughs> All right, all right, let's keep going. Let's okay, keep going. Okay, Vittles okay, okay. Yeah, keep going. Vittles aside. Yeah, you're right. We're back. <laughs> Vittles aside. <laughs> uh, okay, okay, okay. I gotta bring it back. I gotta bring it back. <laughs> I just thought it sounded cool. I would like to try it, though. You Why wanna take me out for, for a drink? Yeah. <laughs> Why don't we go for drinks sometime then? Ooh, are you asking me out? Uh, so you were after something else. No, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Yeah, I'd be up for that. But only if we find one of the seven mysteries. All right. Then let's get to work. Victor says, okay, Victor says it's from Latin, like like vitamins or vital. Mm. Oh. Fascinating. Sorry, sorry. I'm, I realize I'm going back to the vittles. <laughs> vittles uh, aside, I had Allison. Fo- vittles aside. I had to follow that up real quick. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, I don't know how she's so comfortable talking about spirits and the paranormal at a time this time of night. Whether she's got guts or she's just used to it. Unless. <laughs> no, it can't be. Mm. What do you mean? No, it can't be. Her being a spirit. Oh, yeah, that's fair. Seven Mysteries of Honjo. <laughs> I just remembered, I actually did some research on the Seven Mysteries of Honjo at the library. You did? What did you find? Well, I discovered a few interesting things. Oh, tell me everything. Seven Mysteries. Although they're called the Seven Mysteries, the literature lists nine of them. Oh, I'm surprised you picked up on that. Nice researching. Some people think there could be up to 15. That's the thing about these old folk tales. Stuff gets added to them over the years. That's more extra stories than the main ones. Yeah, but the seven mysteries rolls off the tongue way better than nine or 15. If you say so. But it makes sense, don't you think? It's more likely to be passed on if it's easy to remember. Hmm. That's a good point. (laughs) Just gonna not question it, it's fine. (laughs) Are they really ghost stories? So, I read some of the stories and none of them were, well, scary. I thought these were supposed to be ghost stories. That's true. They're more like a collection of superstitions, really. But there are some pretty disturbing ones in the mix. Yeah, like the one that's supposed to take place here. The Whispering Canal. People who fished in this canal would hear a voice calling out, uh, saying, leave it. They had to abandon their catch or the canal would take it. Right, right. Is that what you're expecting to find here? In this park? Um, not quite. 
We are talking about a folklore from hundreds of years ago. After centuries of the telephone game, who knows if it's anything like the original story? So, basically, you think the true story of the Whispering Canal might be completely different from what we know? Exactly! I'm sure it is. I mean, weren't you curious? About what? People from around here have that expression left at the canal, right? Meaning to abandon someone. This story is where it comes from. Except the story being told today is about fish. There's nothing in it about leaving people behind. So that, now that you mention it, that's true. So you're saying the original story maybe did involve someone being abandoned? That's what I'm trying to find out. Mm. Gotcha. That's for sense. Hmm. Uh, oh. Oh, sorry. Okay. You can't be serious. Is this a repeat? Okay. Uh, it just didn't have the check on it, so I wanted to double check why. Uh, oh, interesting. Yeah. Okay. About the rite of resurrection. Oh, by the way, were we talking about the rite of resurrection? Ooh, your memory is as strong as your tolerance. I'm going to start calling you Martini Man Shogo. I'm really climbing up the drinks menu, huh? So, you know about it, huh? The Rite of Resurrection. A magazine ran a feature on it recently that got practically everyone talking about it. Really? Maybe that's where I heard about it. Still, I don't know. It seems a little too far-fetched to be true. So, the Rite of Resurrection. It's the forbidden art of bringing the dead back to life, concocted by a famous Onmyoji from an ancient age. Rumor has it, an old manuscript containing actual concrete details about the rite was discovered. Recently. <laughs> Sorry, I missed that word. <laughs> This rumor comes from a present this rumor comes from a presentation given by local historian historian uh Hideki Arash oh wait, I read so fast. Uh Hideki Arashi at an official academic conference. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, give sure me out of this. About, you should know a lot about this stuff. I need a drink of water. Hold on, hold on. I'm like, <laughs> go, 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 find it, find it, find it. Also, I'm Get so back sorry. In the game. I'm so sorry, short. I didn't realize there were only two people talking for the whole beginning of this game. I didn't either. I talked so much at the beginning. I thought I'd really be like, around a lot. Me too. Be balanced out. Me too. I haven't had a drink of water in a while. <laughs> It's okay. This is all the exposition talks. Yeah. I'm hoping mm -hmm, after mm -hmm. this we'll like find ourselves somewhere with a bunch I of people. I agree. We know totally. there will be nine characters. Yeah. Yes. At some point. We're going to have a lot to work with. Mm -hmm. Yep. That's because <laughs> I'm secretly a huge occult buff. I kind of got that. Yeah, secretly. Oh. But if a researcher spoke about it at an academic conference, must have some basis in fact. Exactly! That's why I believe the Rite of Resurrection is real! Now I'm starting to believe it too. Good! The pursuit of the unknown starts with belief. I got that from Professor Araishi himself! Hmm. Is this people? What up, Professor, David? um, is he in there? New. No. Beckoning you? light? No, these are all the- these are the seven. Hmm. Okay. He's not like a- like a- per No, okay. Interesting. Oh, persons of interest. Oh, okay. it's only these no. three. So, never mind. Wait, do you want to read about Yoko? Can we look at Yoko's persons of interest thing? Sure. Anything new in here? Yoko Fukunaga, female, housekeeper. After obtaining a junior college degree, Yoko started working at a, as a housekeeper. Due to, her ability, due to her ability to see things others cannot, she has received strange looks from a young age. This ability spurred an interest in the paranormal, which she continues to pursue to this day. Following graduation, Yoko worked a desk job at a trading company, but butted heads with her supervisor, who was skeptical of the supernatural, and quit within the year. 
Now, while working as a housekeeper, she spends her days devouring mystery magazines and visiting haunted spots, as she vowed to live a true, uh, live life true to herself and never change for the sake of others, Yoko has no regrets about the path that she has taken. Yoko has a dog, a Shiba Inu named uh, Ogopogo. Which is oh. Ogopogo. If we don't see that dog, I need to see that we dog. We better see that <laughs> dog, but also, Ogopogo. caveat, I, I hope the dog doesn't die. <laughs> Please don't kill Ogopogo. I would Ogopogo. love for the dog to stay alive. Yeah, unfortunately, my first thought upon introducing a dog is like, Please, no, don't do that. It's a horror story. No, don't, do <laughs> so, it. don't do it. Don't do it. Who has been at her side since she was a student. Aw. Mm. Actually, can we click on the storyteller too? Is that okay? Just want to see if... Oh, that's it. That's it. Okay. Everything else about him remains a mystery. Cool. Okay. Fascinating. Wait, uh, hang on. I've got another question. Hmm? You mentioned the Rite of Resurrection. Are you looking for that too? Does it have something to do with the Seven Mysteries of Hanjo? Ooh, you're sharp! I could cut my finger on you! To tell the truth, it's actually the other way around. What do you mean? Hmm. Well, I started off searching for the Rite of Resurrection, but along the way, I realized that I needed to investigate the Seven Mysteries of Hanjo first. I see. So then... Why are you looking for the Rite? What's that got to do with the Seven Mysteries? Both good questions. Uh, let's do why are you looking for the right? If you're looking into a way to bring someone back from the dead, does that mean you've got someone you want to bring back? Mm -hmm. Um, you know what? Forget it. I just can't, it just came to mind, so I thought I'd ask. I, I didn't mean to pry. Sorry. No, it's fine. I figured I'd need to tell you at some point. Oh. It's no, it's oh, oh, oh no, no, my god, the dog is already dead. God, I, I just <laughs> knew it. There's no, no dog makes it out alive. Oh, that's why she's petting the little animal head. She's talking to all oh, no, oh, no. You're right. <laughs> no, oh, no, that's tragic. No. Oh, that <laughs> dog didn't even last. I know. Five I've minutes. known about this dog for less than a minute, and I'm still devastated. <laughs> oh, little Shiba Inu. Be I bet it was adorable. Oh, oh. no. <laughs> okay. Well, uh, does the dog, dog die? Death. Yes. <laughs> dog death speedrun world record pace says the runner. <laughs> Thank That's you, the really runner. <laughs> oh, go <Pogo>. Okay. <laughs> Ogopogo? Yeah. Og Ogopogo, good dog. Oh. Oh. No, Ogopogo, good. Oh, no, wait. Not dog. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, good dog. No. Nope. No. <laughs> Damn it. You're really going for it. <laughs> it simply does I was not. close, right? <laughs> There's no I was kind of close. There's no D. <laughs> no, I know. I know. I know. I realized that. The P looks like a dog. Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Goop goo! <laughs> Goop goo! Oh god! Okay, well, good job. <laughs> you tried. You tried. There was an attempt. <laughs> <laughs> I'm imagining I am Lord Voldemort and it's like if you take the P and turn, <laughs> turn it, it upside down and, and you add a little backwards. tail to that second O you've got it <laughs> you've got it yeah. <laughs> goop goo <laughs> oh my god oh I do also like goog poo <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> this makes me so sad. <laughs> someone, someone also said ectoplasm dog, which I'm like, yep. Oh, no, she said, yeah. 
<laughs> I mean, oh, truly, dear. if it's a ghost dog, um, oh, <laughs> the post alive dog. <laughs> <laughs> Post dead. <laughs> it's pre dead and post alive. I agree. There's, there's honestly pre-dead alive. Pre-dead. alive. Yeah. <laughs> I hate so much everything on TikTok that says unaliving. I like post aliving. Post aliving. Post aliving. I'm gonna post alive you. No. <laughs> Sorry. Post alive. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Pogo Pogo. No. <laughs> yeah. I want to bring. Ogo Pogo back to life. He died in an accident about a month ago. Dang it, now I'm laughing at this dead dog. This sucks, <laughs> yeah, guys. I know. You've made I'm it too funny. busy it thinking of Goop Goo. It can't be <laughs> funny. Ogo Pogo's death is tragic. Ogo Pogo died? Oh, right. Ogo Pogo was my dog. I had him for eight years. I almost read that as 80 years. <laughs> I was, oh, I guess I got hit by a car. I was like, oh, young dog. Oh, no. Oh. That's Penny's age. A little, oh. little bit. Oh, Penny. Oh, okay. Your dog. <laughs> gotcha. You spent a long time together. Losing him must have been really hard for you. Yeah. To be honest, I'm not sure if the right even works on dogs. But as soon as I found out about it, I knew I had to give it a try. Uh, dep- just, uh, it, it's either old or young, depending on the dog breed, I think is, like, the best way to calculate it. For, yeah. It's a very like, old it, for a golden it, retriever, and it's very young for a terrier. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Not very young, exactly. but it's, it's youngish for a terrier. It's younger. Yeah. Yeah. As far as, like, Sheba's, I'm not sure how it's long a, Sheba's lived. It's a small dog, but it's a pure breed, so... Uh... Yeah, okay. I don't think I could for- I don't think I could forgive myself if I just let the opportunity pass by. Definitely. Now I understand why you feel so strongly about it. Thanks for telling me. I know this must be hard to talk about. Hmm. But you know what? All that led me to meeting you. So at least something good came out of it. Though, that doesn't mean I'll stop looking, obviously. Yoko, I'll do everything I can to help you. Yay! I am so glad to hear that. Let's keep up the hard work then, yeah? What's that got to do with the Seven Mysteries, though? That's That's convenient. So, about the connection between the right and the Seven Mysteries. Putting together everything we've talked about... My guess is that the original stories behind the Seven Mysteries, the true stories, are the key to finding the right of resurrection. And that's why you're here, searching for one of them. Do I have that right? Wow! Ten out of ten! You're proving to be quite the capable assistant! Wait, since when was I your assistant? Anyway, this is all just hearsay, but some say that what led to the seven mysteries coming to be was the rite of resurrection itself. Hmm? Don't the stories come from the Edo period? I thought the rite of resurrection was supposed to be way older than that. Right. It seems that an uh, Onmyoji from the Edo period rediscovered the ancient art. That old manuscript I mentioned with all the details on how to use the rite, apparently it was written in the Edo period. Oh, right. I never told you its name. The manuscript is called The Record of Fates. Mm, what a name. And it speculates that the secret of the rite is hidden within the seven mysteries of Hanjo. So now, the seven mysteries are the new hot trend! Among who? You know, you, uh, you know, this whole thing's starting to sound pretty... questionable. Come on! Remember what I said about the pursuit of the unknown? It starts with belief, right? Okay. Files updated. 
What do we get? Oh, there's like a new tab, so that's cool. I know, but there's nothing did it new there. Did it update something in the Whoa. in those right? <gasps> Things are happening. Whoa. Things are happening. Cool. Whoa. 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 Cool. Okay. All right. Great. We're we're ch Whoa. we're chugging. What the hell? It feels like the air just changed. Think. Think. Oh. Tell <gasps> him to think. <gasps> what did we look like? Yoko, are you okay? <sighs> no, it's us. It's us. <sighs> hey, what's wrong? Stay with me. No. This. This can't be! No, no, no! no. <laughs> what do we look okay. like? We can't look at ourselves, so... I feel eyes on my back. I can't move. Is there something behind me? Oh, she's pointing behind us. I know, that's why Maybe I did we, a little but this when we guy. turn around, we can't see anything. What, can we just, can we think? Yeah. Someone's what does that do? Got Yoko really rattled. Oh, that's it. Okay. Oh, here we go. Maybe we need to find oh. something behind us? I don't have any... Did you talk with her? Did you click on her? Uh, <gasps> uh, 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 uh. Yoko? Yoko? Oh no, we need to <laughs> use your eyes, Shogo. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna think again. I'm gonna think again. Okay. Okay, okay. What? 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 Can you look? <gasps> Yoko's pointing over oh. there, but I don't see anything out of the ordinary. Push? What's Still, push? She looks really spooked. I doubt she's making this up. Damn it. Did I miss it? Oh. I didn't push. Okay, I can. You didn't push? Push. Push. I don't get this. Oh, it's drifting. Oh, it's drifting. Oh, What's no. Did something happen? Yoko? Oh, no. God. Oh, 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 oh no. holy oh, shit. No. Unexpected holy. turn of events. Oh, my no. girl. Oh, my God. Ah. Huh? Oh my god, I didn't think it would be her in I didn't full honesty. Either. Yeah. I didn't either. What? <sighs> Yoko. What the What's what is something's What is it? Why is this happening? What uh... Are we wait, are we now Shogo? We were Shogo. Not Shogo. Oh, sorry. Well, yeah. What's, Sho What's her name? Yoko. Yoko. Sorry. Sorry. My brain had a whole lapse. Yoko! Are we okay. swapping? Answer me, Yoko! No way. It can't be. Why? Why? Oh, no. It's just proceeding, I guess. Yeah. What? Uh... Oh, 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 no, 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 And I don't feel a pulse. This, this can't be happening. Okay, 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 okay. An ambulance, right? I I gotta call an ambulance. I need a phone. Phone booth, phone booth, phone booth. Right, the phone. I've gotta call an ambulance. Oh, you can run over there. Okay, 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 okay. I called it in. The ambulance shouldn't be long. Is it gonna make a difference? Her body's gone stiff and her skin is cold. I don't think she's breathing. We're just sitting here looking at her. She looks more like a mannequin than a person now. Ooh. I don't think there's Ooh. any coming back from that. I don't get it. Just a few minutes ago, we were chatting away without a care in the world. Yoko? 
How did this happen? How could someone so bright and bubbly just suddenly drop dead? <gasps> Whoa. Huh. Whoa. Oh. Oh, that's right. If the rite of resurrection she was talking about really does exist, there might be a way to bring her back. If someone can just drop dead out of nowhere like that, like they were cursed, then why shouldn't there be a way to bring them back to life? Yoko believed in it. So if I believe in her, it seems completely possible. Maybe, just, just maybe, I can still save her. Even if I've got to deal with spirit senses and curses or whatever, I've got to try. Wait for me, Yoko. I promise I'll use the Rite of Resurrection to bring you back. I'm gonna be real, I would be... I, I would not mess with a curse after seeing that. No, no, no. I would be like... After seeing no. that, I'd be like, Absolutely I'm so not. sorry, my friend, goodbye, farewell. Yeah, yeah it's like, oh, wow, it like, seems like what you were saying is real. Never mind, I'm not nope, gonna I'm, investigate any spooky curses. Not touching that. Yeah, like, I, I, we just met very mm -hmm. recently. You are my friend, but I don't want to mess with that. Yeah, I, mean, I don't want I, spooky like, golf would... face flying at me and, and killing me instantly. <laughs> no. Like, I would maybe investigate, but I wouldn't be like, I gotta bring her back. I mean, maybe I would. Maybe he's, like, really committed. I don't know. Yeah, like, I don't know. I just, th that would be just... a definite sign not to mess with the occult, I think. Yeah, um, he just he just decided to ride or die like immediately. Yeah. So like, <laughs> okay, wait for me, Yoko. I promise I'll use the rite of resurrection to bring you back. Damn, uh, that's really a leap. Um, I felt a strange presence a few times. Oh, that's you. Sorry, Gina. Uh, right before she died, I, I felt a strange presence a few times, and it seems like she saw something, something that shook her to the bone. Was it Ogo Pogo? <laughs> <laughs> it was Goop Goo. Oh. Goop Goo. No. <laughs> goop Goo. That's what we're gonna call the ghost ghost. Yeah, that is the name of the guy. I, I, I was I was thinking yep. of the same thing. I'm like, unfortunately, <laughs> the ghost is now named Goop Goo. Yeah. <laughs> There's definitely something strange going on. Maybe it's still here. What could she have seen? She mentioned that the rite of resurrection and the seven mysteries were connected. <laughs> so maybe he looks like he's up. posing. I know he looks so <laughs> casual. There's a dead woman right behind him, and he's like, "Man." He's got like hand in his pockets. He's like, "Man, I'd look good if someone took my photo." Yeah, right let now. me just do a casual <laughs> model pose next to this corpse. <laughs> Had something to do with the whispering canal. Whoa! Oh, <gasps> goop goo. Goop goo. Goop goo? that that presence again! It must be around here somewhere, but where? Goopy, come on out. <sighs> I called an ambulance already. It should be here soon. Uh, do surroundings. Spin. Doing a little spin. Well, there she is. Can you click on your- Wait, what's next to her? I just clicked on her, I'm sorry. Oh, you're good. Oh. Of course. I don't know how it took me so long to realize. This has to be some weird prank she's playing. Any second now she's gonna open her eyes, and get up, and have a good laugh at how scared I was. Right, Yoko? You can give it up now. Boy, did I fall for that one! <laughs> you really got me good. Wait, no, I've got it. You really were some sort of spirit all along. There's no way you're really dead. Right? I'm not even fooling myself anymore. There's no going back. Only forward. What's that? There's something on the ground. Did Yoko drop this? Oh! Basket of fish. I didn't Basket notice it fish. until now, but there's a small wooden sculpture <gasps> did... by her side. 
I not literally say she smelled like fish? You did. You did. I, you sensed I, it. I, you did. You, did. you, you did. sensed it in the I air. Did. I knew. I said, you smell fishy. And I'm mad about it. Get out of my face. And now we find it. Yep. We, and now we it's really rude that. of her to have gotten in our face. Yep. There's a small wooden sculpture by her side. It's three or four centimeters tall. Looks like it could be a keychain, but from how rotted it is, it's way too old for that. Despite how tiny it is, I feel an almost palpable malice radiating from it. What the hell is this thing? Let's pick it up. It's ours now. Yeah, let's Curse it. stone fire. <laughs> Great. We got a cursed object. Yay! I love it. Great. Amazing. Uh-oh. Fantastic. Oh, oh, shit. oh, goop goop. Oh, oh. oh goop goop. Hey, goop goop. Oh, no. What's up? <laughs> oh. <gasps> Are these whispering Cornell's memories? Uh, such deep sorrow. A resentful memory is flowing into my mind. Whoa, they turn their backs, they walk away, leave me behind, drop dead. Kill them. Oh, goopy. Those who walk away. Kill them all. You have acquired the power of a curse stone, the whispering <laughs> now. You can use it to kill those who walk away from you. Press, what? Press what? the use curse button to kill your target as they attempt to depart. Huh? <laughs> what? Ooh, rough. Well, sure, yeah, absolutely. It's, that's a, a. Hey, bitch, I wasn't finished talking, and then. Oh, death. What? Death. A murderous impulse seeps into my soul like thick black tar. Or oh, you who so strongly desires the right. Kill them. Should you seek life's restoration, take your curse in hand. Reap lives by reap lives by the score. And claim their soul dregs for your own. Collect enough to sate this vessel. And by their sacrifice, claim the gift of resurrection. Or better yet, Slay your fellow curse bearers. I'm sorry, this is a killing game anime? <laughs> <laughs> yes. <laughs> we won! <laughs> what? This is a freaking. We were in a. I, oh my it God. said nine. It said nine. We're it told a, you up a front. Killing, killing game. game. <laughs> no way. Killing game. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious. For theirs are the equal of droves of lesser souls. Now, go forth and kill. Files updated. Yay! <laughs> so you're like our curse spirit. Oh, nice. This is our, our Shinigami. Oh, it's our body. It was our Shinigami. Aww. It was like goop goop. curses memories <laughs> flowed in directly into my mind. In an instant, I understood everything. When I picked up this cursed stone, the Whispering Canal must have cursed me. I also heard a strange voice. It told me that I, if I wanted the right, I have to kill a bunch of people with this cursed stone and collect their souls. I guess it's good to know that the right really exists. But this thing wants me to kill people to get it? Screw that! Putting my own life on the line is one thing. 
murdering other people is another thing entirely. Not just one person either. Scores, it said. So this is the curse of the Whispering Canal, huh? The curse that traps the soul of anyone who tries to walk away from me. use it. You know, Shogo, I'd for a moment consider that Yoko had this. Yeah, and was maybe that's what I to, was saying. Yeah, I was maybe trying to convince, like, creep you out and convince you to walk away from her. You know, just maybe. <gasps> so she could be like, <gasps> yeah, no. Yoko, yeah, I figured, no I figured we're, a, we're a target. Oh, oh, she kept trying to do shit to make us be like, no, and then, like, walk away. Yeah, and then she'd be like, <gasps> oh, mine. Boof. Whoa. Yep. Yeah, I, wow. I think I think her little her little oddness was very deliberate. But someone I, got her first. But also, oh. unfortunately, Shogo was like, "But that's really hot," and Yuki's like, "God damn it, <laughs> he's a weirdo! <laughs> yeah. Damn it!" <laughs> no, he's asking me out. God, <laughs> ah, I thought I was being overly quirky. I know. Why isn't this working? <laughs> I thought it would be off putting, but no, I'm too much. Curse my good looks. <laughs> Dang it! Am I in an anime? <laughs> damn it! <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's that is my read of Yoko. I could be wrong, but that's where I'm at. I think you were right. <laughs> if I use it, no, no, close champion. No, she said if she underestimated his need for gussy. <laughs> no, <laughs> no. <laughs> that goop goo. No. That's what I was oh saying. no! <laughs> he needed that goop goo. He needed that goop goo. Oh god. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Shogo's still down bad, so he's he's deciding to kill people to bring this lady back to life. Apparently, yeah. there I was waiting for the Jake nose. I was so ready. <laughs> and Claire, you set falls. me up. You set me up for a full hour for that <laughs> landing. I know. I'm, I'm really glad we got there. Honestly, that's what matters. <laughs> oh, that's good. That's good comedy. <laughs> Jake, I missed you. I know. Oh, man. I <laughs> Metal <too>. boy. <laughs> hey guys. <laughs> oh, always a pleasure. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> and collect enough souls, then I'll be able to bring Yoko back. Wow, he is down bad. He's down so bad for this lady. He's down so bad. <laughs> Couldn't have gotten down worse. <laughs> And there was something about other curse bearers being worth more soul dregs. Dude, maybe sleep on it. God. Maybe yeah, go take a nap. Out. Yeah, maybe take a nap first <laughs> and decide whether this is actually what you want to do with your life. Jeez. I'm really at a loss here. <laughs> so funny to me. Ugh. After all that transpired, he's like, wow. I just don't know what to do. <laughs> I know. In this situation, should, should I Shit, kill a man. bunch of people or should I take a nap? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should wait for the ambulance to show up. I know. Or go lie down. <laughs> like, oh, wow. Well, I guess look at our surroundings. Oh. Feels like I'm being watched. Someone there? You. Where are you? Oh, Allison, don't do that. <laughs> oh, my God. I truly thought that was from the game. <laughs> You who I hated See, that. Unfortunately, it sounded like feel good from gorillas. That's literally all that was playing in my head after you did that. But anyway, and um, sitting down on the camel's back, uh, it's got a jack because they don't know why. You're doing really well, that was, short. You're that doing was really a well. perfect impression. That was so good. Literally a perfect impression. It was perfect. Thank you. <laughs> now that I've got my own curse stone and the curse of the Whispering Canal, I'm in way over my head. Was Yoko the one who dropped this curse stone? Does that mean she was the previous owner of the Curse of the Whispering Canal? Then did she know what the Rite of Resurrection involved? I think so. Probably. Okay, this is same. What am I? Oh, hi. Oh, hi. Oh, hi, pal. What the hell is that? It looks like a light floating in midair. Wouldn't like that suck if that was Ogopogo being like, oh, mommy? 
Mom, mommy. <laughs> okay. Well, it seems that there's guess, there's nothing to be done there? about that. Weird. Oh, hi. Oh, shadowy figure. <gasps> now that I look a little closer, is there someone there? <gasps> <laughs> they must be ignoring me on purpose I love that he's like three quarters turned like that he also just looks like he's hovering a little bit because there's no shadow <laughs> yeah. so I do see him just yeah. kind of like hovering and flying through the air a little bit Ooh, like that meme like that hallway yes meme. yes that, I'm thinking <laughs> of the hallway meme yes thank you <laughs> yes yes <laughs> maybe they're waiting to see what I do do you want me to call he's gonna out? Be oh, yeah. he's going to be closer. Oh, this is closer. <gasps> oh, oh, hi. Oh, it's coming close. Is this another one of the seven mysteries? It looks like a will-o'-wisp, maybe. Was there anything about like that in the seven mysteries? Let's check. Let's take a moment to look at our files. I wonder if opening our files counts as like looking away. So I was wondering that back. too. It's going to be really close. Be crazy. I had that thought too. Yeah. yeah. That'd be uh, spooky. Yeah. Anything about a will o wisp? I don't this see one's a, it. A kitsune or a tanuki. Okay. No, no. Mm -mm. Get nothing, yeah. I don't know. The one sided reed? Nope. Nope. This looks promising. Oh, the ever burning lantern. It doesn't say Will O Wisp. No. Okay. Are, okay. Okay, I don't Christ think Christ so. Christ. Okay, all right. All right, great. Soul dregs? What was soul dregs? Sorry. That's that's the oh. dregs that we feed to the, the, the thing for the rite of resurrection. Yeah, do yeah. we think maybe this is a soul dreg? Maybe. Oh, maybe. Interesting. Yes, sir. It does it's it, creeping it, me oh. out, but it's staying put for now. When you look away and look back, I yeah. should probably leave it. Yep, yeah, we're gonna do what a little. What about the man? Oh, it's still there. Oh, really? Yeah, it's oh. still there. Oh, maybe the man. Should we? Uh... Do you want me to Hi, call man. out to him? Dare we call out? Let's yeah. do it. Let's get his attention. Hey, who's there? <laughs> oh. oh no, he's oh. coming up. Oh, is he walking Short. Over? Oh, okay. Finally. It's you. You can have a character. <laughs> I'm in. I'm in the wings. <laughs> oh. Uh, my, how unexpected. It was your curse that killed that poor woman, I take it. What? Oh. Cat got your tongue, Misker Okay. Okie? Okay, sorry. Oh, <laughs> no, I know. I, I, I looked it up. I just mispronounced it. Okay, you're staying put. You stay there. We'll keep our eyes on that. A tall, humorless looking man. He doesn't look familiar to me. He's acting like he knows me, though. Have we met somewhere before? Okay, that's we're done with conversation with him, apparently. Let's. You're still there. We're gonna do a little whoop to do da 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 da. You're still there too. Think. That man. Who is he? He looks to be in his thirties or forties. He's all dressed up in a suit and tie, but somehow he looks really shady. What's he doing here? Was he watching yeah, us just... this whole time? <laughs> I definitely just heard Justin Timberlake in my head whenever you read that suit line. and tie. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Let Something. me show you a few things. Anyway, sorry. <laughs> Allison, wait, that was lit. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Something tells me curses are nothing new to him. If he's one of the other curse bearers, then I need to be careful. He might be here to kill me and take my curse stone. You ooh, really ooh, bought okay. into this so fast, man. He, he, not, not only did he buy into it so fast, but uh, actually... Yes, I acknowledge that. He bought into it really fast. But if they all have curses, then they all have a method of 
killing other people? Like, yeah. do they all have the same purpose with their curses? But they're probably like, like, like it... forbidden actions where it's like mm -hmm. they're really specific or weird or something like that. You know, like, yes. you know, if like, for instance, he kept his eyes on us and backed away slowly with that, he wouldn't be turning his back on us. Right. So we couldn't kill him. I guess uh, so. Correct. Yeah. yeah. So it's I guess it's like navi it's figuring out the limitations. It's kind of like <laughs> Jojo stands a little bit. Um, a little, little bit. bit. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like yeah. Hyper by the rules perfectly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. But by the same token, killing him will net me a lot of soul dregs. <laughs> he was, he is seriously like, I'm, I'm in it I'm to on win board. it now. I am ready to murder for this woman. <laughs> wow. Wow. Okay, staying put. What do you want? Nope. Same thing. Same thing. Okay. Is there anything think, on the I'm going to think again. I'm going to think again. Okay. He's one of the other curse bearers, then I need to be careful. He might be here to kill me and take my curse stone. Wait, nope, the same thing. Okay. Okay. I think you have to click on his face. Have you done that? Oh, he's talking face. Oh, you're right, yeah. you're right, you're right. Sorry, yep. he's, because, uh, you're right. Yep. Nope, you have to so hold his face between your hands. Yeah, I have to, to just good. gently embrace <laughs> Hello. <his cheekbones>. <laughs> <laughs> I still don't have a clue who you are. How do you know me? Have we met? Dear me, it is always humbling to find out that one is not as well known as one believes. Perhaps my name will help you remember. I am Takumi Yumioka. Yumioka. I got it. Takumi Yumioka? Does that ring any bells? I... I think I've heard that name somewhere before. Maybe. So you do not even know my name. How disappointing. Disappointing, but fortuitous. Mysterious stranger, Takumi uh, Yumioka. Ooh, We're looking at your... Oh, nothing. Oh. Absolutely nothing. Oh, wow. We got wow. nothing on this guy. Oh, that's interesting. Well then, Mr. Okie, allow me to make you a proposition. <laughs> She's just dead in the background. <laughs> Horrible. You have a curse stone in your possession. I would like you to give it to me. How do you know? I can't. Both of these acknowledge that it's the case, so how do you know? Mm hmm How do you know about that? Why, I saw the whole thing. That doesn't explain how you know what the curse stone is. Even I barely have a handle on it. You know about the seven mysteries of Honjo and the curses and all that, don't you? But of course, those curse stones, they're terribly dangerous things, capable of killing without a trace so long as their conditions are met. I hadn't thought of it that way, but yeah. Imagine what will happen if one fell into the wrong hands. They would be safer in mine. Don't you agree? Excuse me? Although it seems I arrived too late to stop you from killing that poor woman. What are you... That wasn't me! I'm willing to overlook your indiscretion. But only if you give me your curse stone. No way in hell. For all I know, the wrong hands are yours. <sighs> Very well. I had hoped to settle this amicably, but you leave me no choice. This Takumi guy must have a curse stone of his own. He must have a curse stone. He can't have a curse stone. Hmm. He must. I think he must. Think wait, he a must sec, wait a sec. Wait a sec. Wait a sec. Let's look up. But curse he wants stones. ours. Curse stones. Curse stones. Um, ordinarily, only those with spirit sense can wield such things, but the curse stones allow ordinary people to use them uh, lethally. Oh, never mind. I was wondering I if there must. was like a, you can only touch, like have one in your possession or something like that, but no. Okay, he must. Yeah, he, he was talking about wanting to get, like get them all out of the yeah, wrong Yeah, I think hand. he might yeah. want, mu yeah, okay. he must. I don't know. At least it'd be safe to assume so. He would explain how he knows so damn much. So he can kill me instantly. As long as he fulfills his stone's conditions. Until I know what those conditions are, I can't make any sudden moves. I have to keep him talking. 
learn what I can and figure out a way to get the, uh, get my curse out first. How can I get him to leave me behind? Though, it would be a waste not to take this chance to find out about the other curse bearers. Shogo's a, a weirdo. Can I just say that? Yeah, he's he, yeah. He's giving me like he's giving a uh, reverse Junpei vibes to me. A little bit. Or, yeah. You know what I mean? I was gonna say like just straight Inverse? up light Yagami, like light Yagami. Light Yagami. Yes! You had his his death note for a full like what week before he killed, or was it just like two days, something like that? Yeah. Yes. This is this is. guy is what? doing a light Yagami speed run, like unbelievable. Yeah. Immediately. Yeah. Was his life so normal and boring that as soon as, like, some remotely wild shit dropped in, like, to his lap, he's like, well, I guess I get to kill now. I like, get, he what? Was, he was having some weirdness when he first, like, woke up. So I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm suspect of Shogo, but I'm just saying he's a weirdo and I want to acknowledge it. <laughs> yeah, no, you're right. Yeah. Okay. Um, I could think. I'm going to talk. I need a topic that will keep him talking. My best bet would be about talking to me about Yoko, about my curse stone, what's up with the light. Oh, these are all great. Let's do the light. Uh, that might get him to look at it. You yeah. know what I mean? Ooh. What's up with that weird ball of light? Is that your curse? Whatever do you mean? I'm afraid I see no such thing. Huh. But it's right. Well, <sighs> it's gone. It was right there. I see. Seems you have become the mark of another curse bear. Huh. Ooh. Uh-oh. Oh, oh you, you, I clicked, uh, I know, I know. I, you, I, I, you uh, yeah. investigated him, yeah. <laughs> if I focus, I can recall something useful. Oh, God. Yeah, we can, we can uh, think or recall. Let's Whoa. recall. It's telling us to recall. Takami Yumioka he know me it's not like i've been getting out much i barely have a life outside of work okay, okay. if i want to use my curse on him i have to get him to walk away and leave me behind now why do i convince him to do that scenario one he does what he came here to do scenario two he suddenly needs to be somewhere else He's probably here for my curse stone, so I don't think he's. Uh, uh, I'll get. Uh, I don't think I'd get out of scenario one alive. Scenario two means hoping something will happen by chance, and luck is rarely on my side. So my only hope is scenario three. Something makes it impossible for him to stay. I don't have to keep him away forever. I just need to get him to walk away once. Okay. About Yoko? About Takumi? Yeah. Yoko? About Yoko. Yeah. Let's do Yoko. Maybe if he goes and, like, looks at her. How do you know it wasn't... Uh, how do I know it wasn't you who killed Yoko with your curse? Mr. Okie, if you are hoping to trick me into revealing whether I possess a curse stone, I assure you, you cannot. It is your curse that was responsible, Mr. Okie no matter what you might tell yourself. That doesn't make sense. I only found this after Yoko died. Oh. Don't play dumb. I know you were the one who did this. Whether you choose to believe me is your prerogative, but you are mistaken. But you should know that multiple curses awakened at once at the stroke of midnight. There are, as mi there are many other curses in Hanjo and many other curse bearers. Is it not premature of you to assume that I am the one responsible? Wait, so you're saying that at midnight, a bunch of people became curse bearers? There's no point in continuing this conversation. For all I know, he could be telling me anything. Hmm. Oh, there's more. Okay. Uh, the other curse bearers. Yeah, let's follow up on that. For each of the seven mysteries, there's a curse and a curse bearer, right? Do you know who any of the others are? And what would you do with that information? Your intentions are nothing untoward, I hope. 
<laughs> well, well, here's the thing. <laughs> it is in the hearts of the selfish and insipid of those who would be most tempted by the rite of resurrection that the curse takes root and accurses resentful memories and part a powerful urge to kill, as I am certain you are aware. Maybe, I guess that's why we're like, we gotta kill right now because okay. the curse... The curse is compelling us to want yeah. to kill. Okay. It wants us to, and he's here. That makes sense. Okay, fair enough. Yeah, when we, you know, when we did pick up the curse stone, it did start saying, like, uh, Goop Goo did start saying, like, fill this vessel, like, you know, uh, uh, yeah. I think, yeah. <laughs> She's like, kill, 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 go do it. Yeah, no, it's true, <laughs> it's true, it's true. I'll, I'll, I'll cut Sugar some slack then, I guess. He's still a little bit of a weirdo, though, yeah. so I'm still there. <laughs> you are a victim of circumstance, Mr. Okie, but your situation is exceedingly dangerous. You must relinquish your curse stone for your own benefit before it is too late. Too late? It's already too late. There's no going back. All I can do is keep pressing forward. And if you're going to stand in my way, then I'm going to have to stop you. <laughs> Am I to take that as a threat, Mr. Okie? I would encourage you to exercise more discretion before you fall foul of a curse. <laughs> yeah, that, that no, wow. Shogo is not yeah, really. subtle. Can I, ask, can I ask a question real quick? I know we have to keep talking to this guy, but would y'all be down for a quick break? Would that I'm be okay? In. Is it? Yeah. I'm trying to find a spot, but we haven't killed this guy yet. So maybe, maybe, <laughs> we <haven't laughs> killed this guy yet. maybe we take a break now and then we can keep talking to him and try to get him to turn around. Sure. We I'm can do it. that. Yeah. Uh, cool. All right. I'm then everybody take a stretch, get some water and we'll be back in just a moment. We'll yeah. do a quick fiver and then we'll kill this guy. We'll make yes. him dead. That's we're going to figure it out. Yeah. Kill puzzle. All right. See you soon. Welcome back, everybody. You ready to kill a man? Let's kill, kill a man. Let's kill. make him die. I mean, I unalive or whatever, as we talked about earlier. Um, die, 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 die. Post, die, post die. alive. Yeah, post, post alive. Yeah, you actually, for the rest of the game, you ready to post alive this man? Um, yeah, let's <laughs> do it. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Uh, let's talk to him about himself. Let's get to know him a little better. Yeah, talk to me. What's your deal? Before I give you my curse stone, I want to know who you are. I need to know if I can trust you. Hmm. A reasonable enough concern? Very well. I am an associate of the great sorcerer Swigon Kamyoda. That's not what I expected you to say. Swigon Kamyoto? Yoda. Yeah, it's a G. <laughs> Swigon Kamyoto. Oh, oh, oh yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's a G. Got it. Indeed. You must have heard of him. I believe he was recently featured in a certain magazine. Your unfortunate companion there came seeking his counsel not a few days ago. It was from her that I learned your name. I thought she would have mentioned me to you, but it seems that was presumptuous of me. And when did this happen? Why, just two or three days ago. Gotcha. Yeah, I'm not buying that. <laughs> he knows I don't know who he is, so he's just trying to feed me a story. I really like your voice for Shogo, by the way, Gina. It's great. Thank you. It's working I, great, yeah. It, I, I'm not sure he's actually supposed to be that kind of, like, low-key flippant, but at the same time, it keeps working, so maybe no, I was I like right it. I off buy the it. bat. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah, totally yeah, no, yeah. I'm here for it. Cool, 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 cool. I've only known Yoko for a month, but she never mentioned going to see some mystic. Although it is Yoko we're talking about here, so it's hard to say for sure. I hope that is enough to convince you that my hands are more than trustworthy. Okay, let's try again. Uh, my my curse stone, I guess. Why is, or Yoko. I clicked on Yoko already, but let's try that again. Why are you so convinced it was my curse that killed Yoko? Just more to say, got it. Why? It is simply that. Huh? Huh? I do believe I just saw your companion move. Ooh! <gasps> she what? Don't turn. 
Don't, don't turn your back. Turn. Don't turn your don't back. Don't turn. No. What are you doing? Should you not check on her? <laughs> no. Uh uh, uh my curse stone. What do you want with uh, the uh, curse uh, stone uh, anyway? Uh, uh. Yeah, I know. Look, we're gonna we're gonna go through this and then we'll see. What do you want with my curse stone anyway? I intend to seal it away in a secure location so it may never be used again. I am certain that you too would rather be free of this burden. But the power to kill without fear of consequence is in itself a curse. There are many ne'er-do-wells in this world who would not resist the urge to use it. We did pick that option at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. I guess for 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 reviving, but we didn't know that the first part of the reviving was the killing. Yep. Oopsie. <laughs> <laughs> all the more reason. Uh. Uh. All the more so if promised the chance to resurrect the dead. You'll seal it away. How? I will put it in the care of a sorcerer who is well-versed in supernatural matters. Hmm. If I have gained your trust, I must ask you to hand me your curse stone. No. I don't have to keep him away forever. I just need him to get to walk away just once. Takumi Yumioka. God, how the hell does he know me? It's not like I've been getting out much. Okay, that's the same thing. Wait, but sit! Anything? My work! That's how he knows me! I've never actually met him, so it totally slipped my mind. Ooh! <gasps> the man who Ooh, is nice. covertly watching me, uh, in, uh, watch- uh, never mind, this is just normal narration. Watching Shogo- Secretary? <gasps> yeah. Secretary to the chairwoman of Hihaku Soaps. Uh, yep, okay, Ooh, all right. Company headquarters. Okay. Takumi oh, worships we got the company now. chairwoman, Natsue uh, Yamamori, and demonstrates his unwavering loyalty through his swift and exact execution of every task given to him. Just as Natsue Yama, uh, Yamamori continues to exert tremendous influence over the company since her retirement from the presidency, so too does Taku uh, Takumi continue to support her behind the scenes. Acting as Natsumi, uh, uh, Natsue's mouthpiece in this capacity has earned him the ire of the current president and the board of directors. Takumi knows the names and faces of not only all the employees at the head office, but also the temporary workers in their factories and warehouses and even their main suppliers. <laughs> wow. Grace is pretty great. It's him, the regional manager. I know. <laughs> <laughs> that is funny. He's also that's apparently me. a simp, so that's exciting. Yup! Hell yep. yeah. Yeah. Hell Sweden yeah. Gam Yodo, my ass. This guy thinks he can sell me anything. But I don't know if having figured that out helps me much right now. I want to try? Ooh, I don't know yeah. if this is a branching path type of things. I'm gonna save. Yep. Oh, good call, because we are totally not turning around to look at our no. companion who is- No chance in hell. Nope, absolutely yeah. not. Swigen Gamayoto, my ass. I know who you are. You work at Haihaku Soaps, just like me. You're the chairwoman's secretary. Well, that took you long enough. Your lack of company loyalty is frankly astounding. <laughs> Allow me to reiterate my request, then, not as a stranger, but as your superior. Hey, we're not at the office. I don't get to- uh, you don't get to push me around like that. <laughs> Why is our chairwoman secretary even out looking for curse stones anyway? I refrain from revealing myself precisely to avoid such questions. But I suppose needs must. Since the dawn of the Showa era, the land of Hanjo has nurtured our company's growth, and vice versa. It is our duty to ensure that curses do not take root in this land we know as our home. I'm not sure I'd buy that. Like many things, it is not a matter that concerns the rank and file. The chairwoman has no desire to spread fear through our beloved company's birthplace. Now, if that is all, I must insist that you hand me your curse stone. 
I really enjoy g- ghost soap. Gop. Ghost soap. <laughs> Gop. 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 I don't have to keep him away forever. Oh, I just thought of something. Wait. I've got it. I know how to convince him to leave. There's some soap over there. Got it. Oh, go get your gope. <laughs> go get your gope. Oh, crap. I totally forgot. What is it? I called an ambulance. The ambulance! We did say that. Yeah. All right. I forgot to mention, I called an ambulance. It should be coming any minute now. An ambulance? Have you lost your mind? (sighs) They will arrive to find you standing next to a corpse alone in the dead of night. Not how they will hand you over to the police. We'll have some questions for you. Probably. But I'm sticking with Yoko. (sighs) Unless you want to join me in an interrogation room, you better get out of here. (sighs) You're telling me the truth, I see. They're getting closer by the second. (gasps) I cannot afford to be waylaid at this juncture. Do it, do it. Use curse. No, he hasn't turned his back. He hasn't turned his back. I fear okay. I must take my leave. <laughs> okay, I guess you gotta wait for him to turn. <gasps> Can we- wait, 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 wait. <laughs> He's about to turn. We about to kill this asshole? Are we actually about to kill this Can asshole? Can we that not? Like- I don't know. I don't know what- I don't know if it's in my power to not kill this asshole. That's he's a thing. Leaving I think the goop goop and wants us to. Like, I know, but he's leaving and use curse is clickable. You know what I mean? Yeah, but he's also not left yet and use curse is li- clickable, so... Uh, that's true. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see. Sooner or later, I will return for your curse stone. I only hope you do not abuse it in the meantime. <laughs> he turns and walks away. Wait, wait, wait. How does he not know what our curse stone does? Like, because why would he know he that has that no archeti- idea. Yeah, we don't so, know what his yeah. does. Every stone's different. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, okay. All right. Oh, <gasps> do you want me to do it? it? Do you want me to do it? Or do yeah, you not want I me to not do, do it? it? Save, save, save. Make a save. Make a save. <laughs> Make another save. Or that I'm one. I'm stressed. I'm stressed because games like this, I'm always like, save everyone. Everyone can be saved. I'll but not every do game it. has their own I'll not rules. do it. Nah, get him. So I- get him. Get him. <laughs> nah, I say get him. Let's go. <laughs> I want to see this shit in action. I want to see if it's real. I don't believe it until I see it. That's how I'm reacting right now. Allison, that's terrifying for us to know. I I do feel like I have a shoulder angel and devil here. Short's like, (laughs) everyone can be saved. You know, pacifist route. And Allison's like, no, we have a mechanic. Let's use it. Allison, how have you and I switched places? I feel like we're typically opposite of this. You're totally right. Normally, I'm the pacifist. That's so true. You know what? Hey, guess what, everyone? Fucking kill him. We made a make save. Him, make we him die. We made, we made a save. Post alive, <gasps> this asshole. Yeah. Yeah. Goodbye. <laughs> Shoko okay. You dare. <coughs> Unmoved. Wow. <coughs> Literally no reaction. No, wow, it's okay. It's the same pose. See, this is what I... It gave, this gave me information. Yep. Because now he's in the same pose. It, and so they were killed by the same curse. That's worth knowing. They were killed by the same curse. Yeah. I wonder, I wonder if, not we, normal. if we choose <laughs> not to... Whether we get got, like maybe because we turned our back on um, uh, Yoko, maybe she decided not to do it and and she got got because she didn't use it. Oh, maybe, maybe, maybe. So maybe do you think like in that instance, if we hadn't uh, used the curse, we would have like- gotten got by by Goop Goo. That would be interesting. Maybe, yeah. That would be. Oh, I, I we don't... didn't do it, but that would be like that. That's my guess. Mm-hmm. That that's would a be good super guess. Super interesting. Yeah. Uh-huh. Mostly because it's the same curse, which means it wasn't a target from somebody else. Right. Yeah. Interesting. So there, there, there's almost an aspect of 
self-fulfilling, self-preservation in this a little bit too, potentially. I mean, we don't know yet unless I don't know. I, I, and and I don't what know. I said is utterly baseless other than the fact that we did turn her back on Yoko and she did die the same way that Shogo did. Mm-hmm, I mean, not Shogo, mm-hmm, that, mm-hmm. that uh, Yukino did. So that's just mm-hmm. interesting. Yes, okay. absolutely. Yes, absolutely. I This was very interesting information to get. Uh, uh-huh. Shogo is a freak, though. He had no reaction nothing, to this. Nothing at all. <laughs> There's something off with him. I don't trust him. No, not at all. Not even a little the bit. The boy ain't right. <laughs> huh. He's dead. <laughs> He's really dead. Holy shit. This is what a cursed stone can do. Oh. Cursed Stone of the Whispering Canal has gained 1% soul dregs. That's a low person. Oh. We killed a person. Is 100 souls? Is that the goal? Well, that also suggests that maybe he didn't have a curse Stone. Uh, you know, I don't think he had a, a curse Stone. A whole 1%. <laughs> Boy. I left the park immediately. I yeah, get out of there. Yoko, but I, I couldn't stay there. God, this, he's spooky. Uh, he's, yeah, yeah, he is. The emergency medical services will probably take care of her body. Takamis, too. This will all be over. Uh, well, this will be all over the news tomorrow. But until then, I at least know she'll be in a safe place. All right. I have to find my next sacrifice. Quickly. I've got no time to waste. Oh, so we're find... immediate. We gotta kill. Got yeah. it. I need to find the other curse okay. bearers and collect their souls. Killing Takami barely got me any soul dregs. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm laughing. The couch is like, you don't though? You don't though. Like, <laughs> you don't have to do this. No, he needs to. <laughs> he, he's being compelled supernaturally by Goop Goo. I know. It's, it appears so. Like, I think so. Yeah. I guess he mustn't have been a curse bearer after all. It's not enough. The soul of a non-curse bearer amounts to little more than a leftover breadcrumbs. I have to think of places where the other curse bearers of the Seven Mysteries would be. The curses were activated at around midnight. The others were bound to be active still. I should check to see if there are any other places with connections to the Mysteries nearby. At the very least, another curse bearer might be thinking the same as me, meaning I could run into them. Let's see. Which of the Severn Mysteries are closest? Do we think this is a game with a lot of different endings? Oh, uh, that's a good question. No, I have no I idea. Know. I have no idea. I wonder. I wonder too. Yeah. This game is wild. Yeah, this has been. Like, this is a fun intro. Yeah, this is really cool. I'm in uh, Kinshicho. I'm in the Kinshicho area right now. Okay. The haunting clappers are on the other side of the <laughs> Oyoko River, just over Sumoku Bridge. The foot washing mansion and the ever burning lantern are around South uh, Warigeswe Street, uh, Street, past the train tracks. And further along Oyoko River, I'll find the beckoning light of Honji Bridge. Those three places are the closest. I guess I'll start there. Think. Oh, and now we've got move. Yeah. I'll collect the other curse bearer's souls before dawn and bring Yoko back to life. I should go to the other location, uh, to another con- uh, location connected to the Seven Mysteries of Honjo. Items. Curse stone. There it is. Okay. Is this the same thing? Yeah, it is. All right. Which one do y'all want to pick, I guess? Ooh, um, oh. Ooh. Do we want to... Hmm. Let's do Wari Gesui. Wari Gesui Street? Yeah. yeah. Let's do it. Right, let's do it. That's cool with me. South Wari Gesui Street. Both the foot-washing mansion and the ever-burning lantern are from this area. 
Ever burning lantern. Okay, okay, okay. This late at night, even a road as big as this. Uh, this one is silent as the grave. Is it just me or is it oddly dark around here? I was noticing that too. I it's was like, like, it's really weird yeah. looking. Yeah. It's very dark and it's very empty yeah. for us like to be in Tokyo. <laughs> you it's know? true, although it's in, uh, I guess, the 80s maybe. That's I true. I guess so, yeah. 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 I keep forgetting time period is like sort of specific. Yeah. Yeah. Crazy. Yeah, that's true. Could some could one of you look up when the color TV was invented? I got it right now. I'm on I'm on the hunt. Thank you so much. I know it's past midnight, but it still seems oddly dark around here. And this feeling it's the same as before. Ooh. Ooh, ooh! <gasps> there, there's something over there. Is that a curse echo? A curse of the seven mysteries given form? How do you know that? Because he, his We're mind got to info inherit. blasted. Yeah, yeah. that's fair. Also, yeah, yeah. The answer is actually more towards the sixties. Oh, there. Okay, um, there you go. Yeah, it I was, was guessing seventies. I mean, so sixties, it is. All right. It it became mat uh, like like. Sometime between 1946 and 1950, it was actually put together and then got sent out to market within the late 50s. Uh, and then by the 60s, you know, they were in every home. Okay. That kind of idea. Gotcha. Were they like more radio. common? In, yeah, because I, I, I recall that, like, you know, they weren't really ubiquitously in homes until, like, the late 60s. I would say early 70s. Yeah. I don't know. Because, like, I know my dad talked about like growing up with a, a black and white TV and then eventually switching over to color. To color, yeah. Yeah. My guess is this could be anywhere from like 1968 to 1985, you know, anything yeah. in that time. I, I think yeah. you're right. Um, okay. Yep. I knew it. There's a curse uh, wait, bearer they, around here. Yeah. Yeah. I was going to say, though, he is 25 and they did say that he was, what, born around the, 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 the onset of the color TV is that what they is that what the storyteller said? Oh, born around the same time. Wait, scroll up uh, on his personal of interest page. Born in Western Tokyo to an ordinary family around the same time as the birth of color TV. So That's... the birth of it, he was born. Let's just say 1950. It's a, okay, so, so it is in the 70s. We're in the 70s, yeah. Yeah, this is feeling We'd very 70s be 70s. to me. Agreed, yeah. Yeah, 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 I kind of feel that. Yeah, that scans. Yeah, and Storyteller did say that, you're right, Tato, that uh, they said earlier that color TVs are common in the house in households now, so that would be 70s. Um, okay. Decision time. We'll be strong and say 1975. That's the I like 1975. Yeah. Let's say yeah. it. <laughs> Until proven wrong. Decision yep. time. What should I do? If I sit here like this, I risk fulfilling the conditions for the person's uh, curse. It seems like I can still back out if I want, but, but do I want to? I mean, I killed that last guy, so let's make it worth it, you yeah. know? Yeah, we're trying to get that juicy soul energy. <laughs> let's do Don't it. Don't say juicy. <laughs> Don't say juicy. That goop goo is not juicy. That juicy goop goo. <laughs> mm, girl, I want that juicy goop goo. Oh, no. <laughs> not a fan. Not a fan. Anyway. <laughs> is that curse echo what's causing this darkness? It doesn't seem hostile. Is it trying to tell me to come closer? <laughs> what should I do? Chat, stop it. Not soul juicy. <laughs> stop. <laughs> stop, no. <laughs> soul juicy. That's horrific. Let's I'm get so closer. I'm, I'm just sitting here shaking my head. <laughs> like, literally physically shaking my head. Um, she's just, like, waiting for it to be over. <laughs> I am. I am indeed waiting for it to be over. <laughs> I want like, that on a shirt. Like, gotta get that soul juicy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Thank God, Gina. I was sitting here being like, Gina, say it. I want you to say it. <laughs> I'll say, I'll say, you can, I'll say soul juicy. <laughs> I'll say soul juicy all day long. Yeah. <laughs> 
All right, get okay, closer or okay, observe. Closer what are we thing. doing? What are we doing? I want to get. I want to get closer. Let's, Let's get, get closer. closer to it. Yeah. Nothing's gonna happen if I just sit and wait. Let's check it out. Oh, that's a person with a floating head. <gasps> oh, oh, we're dead. Darn it, now what? This isn't a curse is doing. Somebody's pulling me in. Ah, that hurt. It looks like I'm inside a building. D did it toss me in here? I can't see squat. Is this the same darkness from the curse echo? I'm completely enclosed. Doesn't seem like there's even a window. There's no telling what direction I'm facing. <gasps> Whoa, what the? Ah! My, my stomach, it feels like it's ripping apart. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, uh, we might have been got. Oh, my stomach. I think we got, 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 what? I think we got deaded. Oh, man. Damn. Whoa. Oh, that's hey, buddy. a- Hey, oh, buddy. Hi. Hello. My, my, Roscoe. You seem to have arrived at a less than favorable result. We fucked up. <laughs> this is mere conjecture on my part, but... Perhaps you should have survived. If only you could have done something about the pesky darkness. Fear not. You may make as many attempts as you please from before approaching the curse echo. Very well. Just remember, it is never wise to linger in the dark. Okay, so we need the ever-burning lantern, probably, in order to deal with <gasps> the darkness. So this Ooh. might just be the wrong place to be, maybe? Yeah, but yeah, the ever-burning lantern is possible. also here. That's true, that's true, that's true. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, do, is it worth it to think, or no, you've been thinking? I've, thi I've, I've, I've been thinking, but I will, <laughs> I, I will do, um, uh, observe. Maybe, I was gonna say, maybe we observe it? See what it does? Yeah, no, approaching it would be stupid. <laughs> I should keep my distance. Okay, you did it in another timeline, man. <laughs> yeah, We're so... Gonna... Yeah, I think you're right about the the ever-burning torch. Um, like, we're gonna need that in some way. Unfortunately, I I can't 360 turn here, just so you know. That's why I'm... Oh, you can't? No. It won't let you? I can only... This is as far as I can go. I mean, we could try and get into the darkness again and see if we could do something about it. I don't know. I can, uh, what maybe. if you move and move leave? Do. I think we just can go somewhere else. Want to go? Oh, maybe we can go else. somewhere else. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, but this, but isn't where I guess Suey Street where the Ever Burning Torch is it as is, well? It is, but also I don't, I can't. I've been, I don't see anything else. I don't either. Yeah, I don't know what to click to on. Yeah. yeah, let's just go somewhere else. This is probably... I'm interpreting this as a dead end for now. And maybe we go somewhere else. Quite possibly. Let's go Hanji Bridge. Yeah. Oh. Hello. Oh, there's a <laughs> person here. Hi. Hello. I'm here at Hanji Bridge. The location linked to the beckoning light. That also could be useful. Oh, uh, well, there we go. Okay. Man? Man. Someone's standing on the bridge, silhouetting themselves against the sky. Observe? Let's observe real quick. Yep. Observe him for a sec. Yep. Ah! Hi! <laughs> Whoa! Oh. Uh, should I be this man? Is yeah, it you my want turn? To Am I up? Yeah. Wait, wait, wait. Fine, I'll go first. I love when you do a southern accent. Whoa. It's so oh, much fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Oh, I, I see. I see. Are those sunglasses or is it a double locket? What's going on with this? That's a good question. <laughs> I mean, they're not like literal sunglasses, but like a sunglasses necklace or something. I don't know. Pretty boy, oh, though. It, it could, could also be his uh, curse object. He is a beautiful man. Very pretty boy. <laughs> well, now, this is a surprise. <laughs> hmm. 
Who are you? If, uh, if you've got the wrong guy, just say so. Oh. Can we... He's a flamboyant fellow. I wouldn't bat an eyelid if this were the inner city, but he stands out like a sore thumb in these parts. I guess we talk to him. Come now, won't hurt. At least tell me your name. Hmm. What are you doing here? <laughs> very good. You shouldn't get. Oh, very good. You shouldn't give up your name so easily, especially not to strangers. Hmm. Gone is the age when might uh, when might be. Bleh. Gone <laughs> is the age when might made right. Nowadays, it's information that rules the world. You'll do well to remember that. You're the one who asks. Your name, your address, your phone number, your age, your occupation. Your personal information is much more valuable than you might think. You should treat those things with care. So, I guess you don't plan on telling me anything either, then. You can call me Richter Kai, private detective. Of course he's a private detective. Of course he is. <laughs> that scans. Uh, okay, this guy. <laughs> but didn't you just say not to... No, never mind. He also looks decidedly 70s. Yeah, so... <laughs> you say you're a detective? He's also doing a JoJo pose. Yes, he he's right very now. much doing a JoJo pose. <laughs> <laughs> That's correct. I'm a man who deals in secrets. Don't expect me to share any more information with you, though. I only told you that so we could have an understanding. Richter Kai. All right. Hey, Richter. <laughs> An eccentric man that Shogo Okie ran into in Hollandu Bridge. Okay. okay. I love this dude. <laughs> <laughs> A detective? Really? Dressed like that? He may look ridiculous, but he knows what he's doing. I don't want him finding out about me. I don't think he's a curse bearer, so I'm better off just leaving him alone. Hmm. I can't change my view, so I'm gonna talk to him. Okay. What's a detective doing around here? Working, and that's all I'll say about that. Click, please. Okay. Thank you. Sorry, the click <laughs> just wasn't going through. It happens, uh, yeah. <laughs> you're good. I could ask the same thing, ask you the same thing, though. This seems like a strange place to stop. What brought you here? I saw a strange man. I'm looking for someone. Why should I tell you? We saw a strange man. How about, man. I'm, uh, I saw a strange man. Let's do that. I saw okay. a strange man look lurking around. I see. Then let me ask a different question. Why did you go out of your way to strike up a conversation with that strange man? I'm looking for someone. I figured it was worth seeing if you knew anything. You don't say. In that case, I just might be able to help you. Can you describe the person you're looking for? I'm looking for the beckoning light. We want the light. I mean, yeah, be honest. Let's do it. <laughs> I know I said a person, but uh, I'm actually looking for something called the beckoning light. The beckoning light? Aha. Uh -huh. The seven mysteries of Honjo. That's right. A friend of mine was really into that kind of stuff. She said the beckoning light appears here in the middle of the night. I wanted to see for myself. <laughs> really? You're the adventurous type, aren't you? 
Unfortunately, I think you're out of luck. I've been here a while, but I haven't seen any strange lights. Alright. Well, thanks for telling me. But just wait one second. There's still time left for it to appear. Why don't we uh, wait together? Thanks. I don't trust this guy. I don't I'm trust good. this guy, even though I'm sitting here like twirling my hair. Like, <laughs> <laughs> uh, really? <laughs> well, I'm sorry I couldn't be of any more help. Doesn't seem like he has anything to do with the curse bearers. I should move on. I guess so. That's a hell of an assumption to me. Yeah, this is also a big <laughs> intro for a character that doesn't that doesn't yeah. matter, so yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. If he's been here as long as he says, there's a good chance he's seen something. But I don't think it's worth asking. He seems like all kinds of trouble. You have strong opinions. <laughs> he he yeah, makes truly he makes assumptions and judges and just like jumps to conclusions. He really does, Fair Look, yeah. You know what they say guy. about assumptions. Ass out of you and me. Uh, don't make them, you know? Yep. Uh, <laughs> Hongji Bridge has a pretty unusual structure. The ends are stone, but the middle is steel. The Ayoko uh, River beneath it is actually a canal that was dug during the Edo period. Great uh, belt. He does have a good, a good belt. belt. It's a yeah. good belt, yeah. The other side is an industrial district. Further down from the bridge is the temple from which it gets its name. Okay. Okay. Can you click on that light or no? No. No. Okay. It's just general surroundings. Hardly anyone around. Not surprising, seeing as it's past two in the morning. Feels like the whole world's gone to sleep. All right. Um. I guess let's go. Yeah. Yeah, anything else to get from him? Let's I mean, check I out. So. I can try, uh, but he seems to have a. Oh well. Oh. oh. I did it, but. Uh, well. <laughs> Shoko okay. didn't want me to. I'm sorry. Fascinating. Aha, uh -huh, that's right. I meant to ask. Do you have a light on you? A light? Uh, you mean for cigarettes? No, I, I don't. I'm not a smoker. Oh no, uh, this will do nicely. Are you sure? What? What is huh? this? What are you talking about? What? Anyway, I should get back to work. Once you're gone, of course. Oh, uh, you are going to kill me. Is there a reason I can't be here? Of course. My work is top secret. Okay, I think what we're was that done. weird cigarette thing? I don't know that what that was, was about. Odd. Hmm. Okay, all right. Let's go to the Shimoku Bridge area. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. Well, that was an interesting lad. Shimoku Bridge is supposedly where the bell from the haunting clappers story used to be. I wandered around here for a while, but oh, I didn't see anything interesting. The only thing I found is what looks like an 100 yen lighter someone ah. threw away. Oh, now we do oh. have one. Vulnerable to fire. That actually might also help in the darkness, too. But maybe <gasps> I'll find a use for it. Yes! Do we want to go light a cigarette or do we yeah, want to go. Yeah, let's uh... go light a cigarette. Hey man. I love if only, if only game logic is my favorite. I, I was about to say, if only to demonstrate that that's how the game logic works. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Something else you need? No, I'm just passing by. Is that so? Uh, okay. Wait a sec. Maybe I can. Items? 100 yen later? <gasps> oh, maybe not. Maybe I needed it for that moment. Oh, maybe, maybe that moment is gone. Yeah, yeah. That interesting. Gone. Okay, okay. So this is interesting. Yeah. Um. That's weird. Okay. But maybe now, when we're in the darkness, we can get our lighter out. Yeah, it's worth a shot. Let's do that. Yeah. Okay. One last experiment before 
before the end. <laughs> I'm just repeating the same actions as we did before. Yeah, that's cool. Totally. I think we're gonna die. Probably. I think we might die too. <laughs> Almost definitely. It's just not even giving us the item option, you know what I mean? Well, like, no, we get put in the darkness. I just figured we could light it up here. Immediately in. Oh, okay, that's fair. Let's see. Okay, someone got us. <gasps> that's right. I still have that yeah, lighter nice. I picked up earlier. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect. It works. Now I can make out my surroundings a bit better. <gasps> what the? Oh! Something. Oh, it's a man. Short? Oh, uh, Dret, he's got a light. That ruins everything. Is someone there? Are you a curse bearer? <gasps> it's over. Time to get out of here. Oh, 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 this is interesting. Want me to get him? He's turning around. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, get we him. don't know who this is. Like, if I don't care. Us. Who cares? He, he, we know we, he kills us. We, we know he kills us. Dead. Fascinating. <laughs> Why? Because you were going to kill us. He we was going to kill us. He was going <sighs> to kill us. <sighs> That was a close one. I didn't catch a glimpse of the curse bearer, but it seems like I'm all right. Oh, we got, <gasps> we got something. Whoa, yeah, we got a curse oh, bearer. Oh, whoa! His curse must have had something to do with light and darkness. I guess would be the ever-burning lantern. <gasps> if we can get that off of him. Yeah, so there's a connection between the seven mysteries and the way their curse works. That might be useful to know. Interesting. I feel like we need to not kill somebody at some point, so if only so that we know what happens. Y yeah, yeah, so like, yeah, we know totally. what happens, or we can figure out who they are and stuff. We know we got this is... them, but we don't know where they are. <laughs> yeah. Which this is starting weird. to feel like it a game like with multiple endings. Yeah. You're right, sorry, we were both talking. Sorry about... Um, I guess okay. maybe its condition is something about being in total dark. It's a good thing I had this lighter. It seems I saved me. Okay. So they don't have any body anywhere? That's just weird to me. Yeah, they're just... Yeah, where's the body? That's odd. We know but our we last definitely... victims left remains. But maybe because our last victims weren't curse bearers? This is or, weird or... now. Okay, yeah, I don't know. We were, I guess we were pulled into the building, but now we're just outside. Okay. I don't know. I've got to look around the area. I should head somewhere else now. Where's he next? First around Midor, uh, Midoricho Park at the end of the South uh, Marigasui Street is the Taiko of Sugaru. North of there is a school called Komagata High School. At the location of the Fool's Procession. It should be around there. Okay, I guess that's just like we did it. I guess we just, we I just did so. it. I guess so. Yeah, I guess, we, I guess so. I guess we did what we were gonna do there. You know, and it, you know? I guess so. And it's so. like, it, it, what's done is done. Yeah. Huh. Whoa. Yeah, maybe so. Okay. Whoa. Okay, this game is fascinating. This game is fascinating. I'm, I'm... I love the the like investigation mechanic um, and the the idea of these kind of like <laughs> cursed like forbidden action curses are really intriguing. Mhm. Mm mhm. Mm yeah. Yeah. Like, and that they're little puzzles. So, I mean, you know what? It might actually be useful for us to actually look at all of the curses because that might give us some clues or hints as to like what uh they do um so that we can be like prepared whenever we encounter them i don't know i completely agree oh. i think that probably would be a good idea for us to start the next time we stream uh with so that we're Absolutely. primed with all that information. that's a good idea yeah we sit down and have a little talk through them all and mm -hmm. get ready to take on some yeah Absolutely. yeah it, it'll feel like a nice little summary before we start the next uh uh, next playthrough as well. Next yeah. Stream. So, I'm. Yeah. I'm really enjoying this. Also, the art is stunning. Oh, the it's art, so good. The entire execution of the way 
dialogue is presented to even down to like the specifics in the zoom in on characters when there's not murder afoot mm -hmm. i think is so ooky spooky um and it's just executed in such a way i haven't seen before mm -hmm. the cinematography is really cool mm -hmm. uh, yeah and i love the use of like the jump scares with the the 360 like scrolling mechanic too yeah no like, they, that first yeah. sequence with yoko was really effective i thought with the spinning and her like her perspective changing and the jump scares and all of that just very very cool yeah, so good. Thanks for the recommendations, everyone. Like, I'm this really is the excited good one. about this one. Yeah, and what's fun is that I know this one's like pretty short, you know, visual novel considered. Yes. Which will also yeah. Also cool to see how it wraps itself. Mm -hmm. Totally. Oh, I'm pumped! I'm pumped! Oh. I'm pumped! Well, thank you all so much for joining us today. I am really excited for this game. Me too. Yeah, I I am really really looking forward to playing this again. Mm -hmm. Like I'm so excited. <laughs> Excellent. Oh. Well, we will see you all in the next time we play this game. Yes. Thank you all so much for joining us tonight. We really really appreciate it. And yeah, we will uh, see you all next time. Big love to you all. Thank you so much for hanging out. We hope to see you on next episode. See you then. Bye. Bye.